Hey everybody, welcome to our next Urban Conquest Battle Report. This is a special one, special mission, as Constantin is assaulting my shield generator. I own the shield generator card, and he chose the Assault Stronghold strategy card, which cost him four strategy points last game. Whatever, whatever, you have a lot, you have, you have so many of those. And so he wants to, we have to play the special mission which involves him trying to take three objectives away from me. It's a very straightforward mission. I have to set up in the center, right here. He can set up all on the outside, I'm the defender. We set up a shield generator and then two linked buildings. They can be linked, they, they suggest linking it with the Prometheum, uh, the, the, the pipes. I just kind of made it look like this because I think it looks cool. And then I place three objectives, one on each of these buildings. So you can see them there, one, two, three. And we play random game length, and uh, if Constantin controls all three objectives at the end, he wins. If he doesn't, he loses. Yeah. But there's some caveats. Uh, first off, I go first. Yeah. Second off, you get to do a preliminary bombardment, which is why half of my stuff are in blips. I still haven't got any official word back on to whether I can put everything into blip reserve. Otherwise, I would have. But essentially, everything that starts on the table, which is not the blips, yeah. he rolls a die four. If he rolls a six, he does d6 mortal wounds to it. If it's an infantry unit, they can choose to go to ground and only take D3, but then they can't do anything in the first turn of the game. On top of that, he has sustained assault. If a unit of his is destroyed, then in basically at the end of his movement phase, he rolls a die for each unit that was previously destroyed. On a four plus, they get to come back. A two plus if they're a troop choice, which a lot of your guys are. And when they come back on a one through five, they come on his edge, which is just that one edge, even though yeah. he gets to deploy everywhere around, only that one counts as his edge. On a six, he can come in on any edge. Wholly within six inches, it doesn't say anything about being more than nine inches away from enemies, correct? No. So, we'll just keep it more than an inch away, obviously. You can't just plop into combat with them. But still, that, that's pretty awesome. And so, he, he'll just get all his guys back over and over again. And furthermore, at the end of his turn, he can choose to destroy any units that are at quarter strength or lower. And that includes single models if they've lost at least three quarters of their wounds. And that allows him to not just have this one stray guy running around not doing anything for him. But he still has to remove it and it's not there for an entire turn and then it shows up at the end of his next movement phase. And we did roll off. I'm not sure if you're not a vault member then you don't know that the random event that's currently in play is Dawn Raid, which is we roll 2d6 if we get less than 7 then for the first turn there's minus one to shooting. We did not actually, we rolled a seven, so there is no Dawn Raid in this one. So no minuses of shooting besides the normal rules for Urban Conquest. Reminder, we're playing Urban Conquest here. And as much as this is a narrative mission, we are still going to be using match play rules for all the stratagems, for reinforcements, all the things like that. On the Gene Stealer Cult side, we have the Hive Cult, Cult Creed. This gives me a couple things. First off, it gives me... Wow, my brain just went blank. I got it, I got it. I can fall back and shoot at minus one. Also, if I fail any morale checks, I lose half the number of models rounding up. Now, a reminder, as you're going to see, I do have some Brood Brothers. They don't get the Cult Creed, so they won't get either of those benefits. But everybody else will. I've got Double Battalion. We both actually have Double Battalion, so we have lots of command points to spend. And so I've got uh, Neophyte Group. Neophyte group, Neophyte group. This one is 11. All the other ones are 10. I had like nine points left over. Uh, each group either has two grenade launchers or two flamers. I got a lot of the bikers, the jackals, the Adelan jackals, just with auto pistol and the cult knives because it's free. So they both, so they each have two auto pistols. They start with an auto pistol, then you have to choose two weapons. And so I chose auto pistol, cult knife. You can't choose two of the same. I could, I can choose auto pistol though, because just within the two weapons that you're choosing, you can't choose two of the same. So I couldn't have three auto pistols, for example, which would be awesome. So they run around with two auto pistols each. The nice thing about them is they're super cheap. They're 40 points for the, the four of them. The one squad will be joined by the quad bike with a, with a basically a long range heavy flamer. Backing them up is three heavy support Goliath rock grinders with the clearance incinerators, no caches of demolition charges, and nobody inside. And then we've got all sorts of blip tokens. Three of them are heavy weapon squads, Brood Brothers, two missile launchers, one mortar. Six of them are special characters. We've got my warlord, the Primus, whose warlord trait is a six inch bubble of rerolling ones to hit for people who are of the cult, so not them, which really sucks. And then we've got an Acolyte Icon Ward who does a six inch bubble of reroll morale and also a six up ignoring wounds. Two Megasus, so we've got four HQ, so I could have the two different battalions. 
also have a Clavicus, which does a bubble of plus one leadership for me and minus one for the enemy. And also you can't arrive from reinforcements within 12 inches of him. And I got a Nexos, who lets me move around one of the uh, cult ambush markers, and also helps me to get extra command points every time we spend command points. And because I have the Primus and the, Cla the Clavicus, then we get the, I get them on five pluses. So it's essentially every time I spend a stratagem on a six plus, I get a command point. But since I have a Primus and a Nexus, I get plus one to that. Every time my opponent does one on a six plus, I get one. But because I have a Nexus and a Clavicus, I get plus one to that as well. And then we have a squad of 10 Neophyte hybrids with flamers. Lastly, waiting somewhere on the table is my brand new Keller Morph. This was just delivered to me today from Ben, who just finished painting it up. He's got three Liberator auto pistols. Actually, one of them has been upgraded to the special relic one. This guy is awesome. He, each pistol is two shots, strength four, minus two, two damage, except for the one that I upgraded. It has three damage and reroll failed wounds against <clears throat> characters. He can target characters, even if they are not the closest, so he's a sniper. And um, he has 12 inch range, and he has a two up ballistic skill. So remember, strength four, minus two, two damage, two shots each, except for the special one of three. So we're looking at seven shots already, each with two damage, minus two AP. And furthermore, every hit he makes with the pistols, he can make another shot. But those do not generate additional ones. So on average, he's going to be dropping in, doing his first volley of seven shots, most likely hitting with five or six of them, and getting five or six more shots. So quite easily, he's going to be getting between 10 to, what's the maximum there, 14 shots off. All at strength four minus two, two damage each, which is pretty, except for three damage with the special. No, no. Know, still two damage, that. but that, that other special one also rerolls, fails, wounds. So yeah, he likes to do that. And then he'll die, because he's got a five up invuln, but toughness three, four wounds, and now he's close to the enemy, obviously. On the Adeptus Mechanicus side, we've got a double battalion as well. We've got our engines, engine seers who keep coming back and mocking me by not being dead. The big dune crawlers are back too, which is too bad because I brought out the Goliath rock grinders. I didn't realize he had these. And then we've got a lot. We got a, things are starting to be a little familiar here. We do have some new stuff on the other side of the table, though. We got more of the breast stalkers. Yeah. We got rangers. No, oh, no. Other way around. Vanguard. Yes. Rangers. Yeah. And then we've got your other troop choices. All your servitor driven. Right. We have we have two breacher units, all with our grapples except this guy because he th he thinks he's special, so he took a torsion cannon. Why not, right? Yeah. Was a, Was he uh, wig? Yeah. And then uh, two units of destroyers with with uh, both the with the big grav cannons instead of the plasma. Lots and of the, grav, lots of plasma. Glass. And then of course a little Dominus man who just refuses to die. I will eventually yeah. kill him and make him stay dead. Yeah. Although on this mission he just gets to come back on a four uh, plus. Yeah. Yeah. And then of course these guys are back. Yeah. Why not? Can we just agree that once I kill them, they can't come back ever again? Uh, no. No. Oh. They only come back on a four up, though. No, I mean like period, like for the rest of the entire campaign. No. 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 Oh, okay. No. And then we got five infiltrators who are currently crawling on their bellies underground, so they can pop up yep. later on. Yep. It's time for the preliminary bombardment. You choose each unit. You roll a die four. If you roll a six, they take d6 mortal yep. wounds. Any yep. of my infantry can choose to go to ground, not do anything for the first turn, but only take d d3 mortal wounds. Let's just go like from one. I'll just point. I'll just yeah. point. Go. So. Ugh. No, infantry. No, yes. uh, they'll go to ground. So okay. D three mortal wounds. So one. one mortal wound instead of two. Boop. Then I'm just going to lie one guy down to represent going to ground. Then we've got the rock grinder. Nope. No, no. Uh, second rock grinder. There uh, he is. Reroll. That's kind of cocked. Okay. I know we could kind of see that. Okay. No. And then third rock grinder. No. No. And then we'll do jackals, jackals, jackals. From that order. Jackal. Yes, yes to the first one, D6 mortal wounds. Oh! Oh, oh good. Four. <laughs> so it kills two of them. That's still a big deal, losing two of them like that. Oh, wait, no, that's my leader. Second jackal squad? No. Third jackal squad? No. And lastly, three neophyte harbor squads, all in that order that I just pointed out. First one. Oh. Yes. Yeah, they gotta go to ground. I gotta survive. Yeah, it's just auto guns anyway. Okay, good. Oh. That's good. <laughs> so three of them die, and one goes to ground. Oh, they're all gone to ground. Again. Second squad, and the third squad. Last one. No, okay. Not bad, though. Yeah. You made me go to ground in two places, killed one there, killed two of these guys, and killed uh, three of them, oh, because I went to ground. Both times I went to ground, I have your, I actually, you rolled a two for them, which became a one, and you rolled a six yeah. for them, which became a three. So I actually saved four of my guys, at the cost of not being able to do anything with them for a turn. Sorry, one more squad. Didn't see it. No. no, they're fine. 
And now the defender has first turn. There is no seizing. It's just Genes to the Cult turn one. We play and call it work. Ah. Mini War Gaming's Warhammer 40k Battle Reports. Couple things I neglected to mention, the Void Shield Generator actually has its own rules. Any unit wholly within 12 inches of it that gets shot at by any unit not within 20, 12 inches of it gets a 4-up invuln. It actually increases to a 2-up against flyers, which won't matter here. I also spent a uh, command point before the game started, or technically as the game started, to upgrade with a key building stratagem. This is something unique to Urban Conquest. Uh, you can upgrade each of them once, and uh, basically a squad that's holding it, and I have to define which squad is holding it, gets to, this one I did the ammunition cache, they get to reroll ones when they're shooting. So I had, there's a bunch of choices. You can do ones that reroll morale, six that feel no pain, uh, invuln saves, but only one squad can ever gain the benefits of it. It specifies that. So beginning my movement phase, I have to reveal my cult ambush tokens. And you're doing Shroud Psalm for your yep. canticle, which gives all your guys cover. Yep. And it has arrived. We've got our heavy weapon teams on the one side. Got a Magus, Clavicus, Nexus, or Nexos, Primus, Acolyte Icon Ward, and the other Magus on the other side, all ready to partay. And none of them count as having moved. So if I don't move these guys, for example, they don't suffer the heavy weapon penalty. So now I just get to do my movement phase. Let's move these neophytes that were positioned here. I guess I could have just deployed them this way. I'm just going to try to get them obscured. They're in cover of being just on this building, but if I can get them obscured, giving that minus one to shoot them. That would be even better. And these jackals are just going to move over here. Hide behind this ladder, though. Vroom, vroom, vroom. This Goliath is just going to move into here. Make sure it's obscured from those neutron lasers. These bikes are going to advance. 14 plus 1. Woo! Vroom, 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 vroom. Yep, you get the idea. This Goliath will just move over to here. Now these four jackals are going to advance three, so 17 inches. So they're going to end up right over here. These hybrids are all going to back up, realizing that everybody decided to show up where they are. And they're like, no thank you. We did not sign up for this. Cliché. Clavicus is going to start to wait, make his way back, but these guys are all pinned, so he's not able to get past them. Uh, Rock Grinder will just hop over here. And the quad bike is going to get his 12-inch flamer into reach of them. And the other guys are just going to kind of stay nearby. Psychic phase. I'm going to smite with this Magus. Need a 5 or higher. Ooh, we got an 11. This unit takes D6 mortal wounds. <laughs> Give me a 6. 4. You know what? I'll keep it. So two of them die. 4 mortal wounds. Ow. Ow. And ow. Ow. Change your mind. Ow instead. Ow. And this Magus is in range of these Dragoons, but I need a six or higher, because this is my second smite. Oh, that rule actually made a difference. You know what? Reroll. Now that it doesn't cost two command points. So D3 mortal wounds. Totally worth it. One, one mortal wound. Yeah. And since I just use a stratagem, my Nexus will get me back on a 6+, plus, but because I also have a Primus on the table, it's actually on a 5+. Plus. Hey, no. Sorry, he's the Primus. I pointed at the wrong model. Cheating phase, a.k.a. the phase where I take all your units down to 1. So you can't get them back on your first turn. I'm going to start with some crack missiles from this first team firing at your um, Rust Stalkers. Uh, now remember, I don't count as having moved for showing up, because it's not reinforcements, it's different, it's its own rule. I am hitting you on fours. Two hits. Twos to wound. Oh, come on. I'm not re-rolling it. It's going to be, because I have height advantage, the minus two will become minus three. So your three up save with cover becomes six up. No. Oh. D6 damage. Oh, come on. Heck, I'm re-rolling it. 
Okay, I kill one. Okay. Yeah, don't care which one. This that was pretty bad. Here. On a five plus, I get a command point. Nope. That's so now I'm down to 11 main command points. Oh, by the way, we both have the Warlord trait where we get three extra command points, but only cities of death stratagems. I happen to have two com uh, Warlord traits on my Primus because um, he, because I bought the strategy thing that lets him have more than one. I'm going to have this Neophyte hybrid squad fire into them. I'm going to do two crack grenades, and they're going to all be rerolling ones to hit because of my Primus. Start with the crack grenades. So they'll be hitting on fours because they're assault weapons, so moving doesn't matter. Reroll in ones. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Toughness, strength six, toughness three, so two's to wound. Oh, come on! I don't have any more rerolls. And then the auto guns, hitting on fours. That's cocked die. Yeah, okay. Wounding on fours. No height advantage, you get your two up save with cover. No, three up actually. Sorry, three up. It's not hard, it's not hard cover. Hey. Good. I forgot the three last cannons, or last guns from them as well. So we're looking at fours to hit, fours to wound. They have height advantage, so you're a four up save against those, so one more wound. Let's try again with this squad. We're going to do the last guns first, followed by the crack missiles. Last guns first, hitting on fours. Crack missiles? One hit? Two's to wound? Okay. What a waste. You already have a guy down to one wound. Six up save? Oh yeah, I made it. Oh, you... <laughs> hey, mortars are next. Same squad. Three D6 shots. <laughs> fours to hit. Okay, well at least the hit roll is good. Threes to wound. Eh, four wounds. They have height advantage, so AP minus one, so you got a four up save with your cover. It, uh, one more okay. wound! Holy crap, man! Oh. The dice don't seem to know what statistics are. Yeah. Rolling low for me and high for you. I'm gonna do these two together because you're not obscured from either of them. Two heavy stubbers into them. Hitting on fives because they moved. Wounded on threes. So two wounds, no AP, so you get your three up saves. Yep. Uh, uh, one wound. We'll do the Adelan Incinerator into them. It's 12 inch range, D6 auto hits. Three, eh. Strength five, so threes to wound. <laughs> two wounds. It's minus one, so basically ignoring your cover, you get four yep. up saves. Hey, look at that. Two of them got through, so finishes off the one and wounds the next one. Let's do some uh, sh auto gun sh shots into your breachers. breachers out front. Mm, yeah, if I fire at them, they'll be obscured. I know they don't have as good an armor save. They're going to be two up armor save. Yep. Oh no, I have height advantage, so it'll still be three up. Eight shots, because there's two special weapons. Hitting on fours. Uh, I am not rerolling ones, I'm not close enough. And then wounding on fives. Nothing. That's all my shooting. I'm not going to be doing any combat, so we have a morale test. You lost five of them at yep. leadership seven or eight. And they're seven, but they get plus one because they're close to a data tether, which this thing has. Did you call it? So they're eight. So basically, yeah. you're looking for a three or less. Yeah, three or less. Anything higher than that, we'll have guys run. <sighs> yes. Where's your high rolls now, buddy? Huh? <laughs> Roll low for leadership and high for everything else? Yeah. I get it. I get it. Well, I did some token damage to you. Now it's time to see if I can survive the onslaught as we go into Deptus Mechanicus, turn one. Movement! Dragoons are moving up. Yeah, they're moving up. Um, I don't think I'm going to be in charge. They're going to advance. Yeah, because they're not going to be Ten able to plus charge anything. Uh, five, five inches. And up they go. And the rest stalkers are going to move up, get ready to do what they do best, which is get in combat. Yeah, I don't want to charge flamers, but ah, what are you gonna do? charging auto pistols is fine with me. And this here will advance yes, yeah. six inches. I don't care about shooting the last pistol. And he's the one. He has a relic that yeah. gives you reroll hit rolls in close yeah. combat. Yeah, six inch the, bubble. The ammunition man, first guitar guy specifically. Vanguard will move up. There. Stain on their cover. So. Big old neutron lasers are just gonna walk on up. Yep. Up he goes. There. The other one will follow suit and they stay within six inches of each other. So to get the extra rerolls they're involved. Yep. And just series will just kinda keep up so and they can repair any damage that I won't do. Yep. Go and ahead, just move them up. Yeah, and just here too. And because these guys are on the road, they and they stay on the road, they get to move nine inches for their regular move. It's very handy running along the road. It is indeed. Which is 
Now these guys can move and shoot heavy weapons without any penalties, right? Yep, but they can only run D3, but when would you ever want to run them? So uh, they're just going to slowly roll in that direction. And the implacable advance yeah. of the Tech Priest Dominus staying behind them to basically run them. He's kind of holding out his data slate and deciding on what targets they get. Shooting phase! First, Dune Crawler, big blazer into the Goliath Rock Grinder yep. back there, and the Heavy Stubber just won this time into the hybrids. D3 shot? shots! Yeah. Oh wait, sorry, I, um, before this, I, I, I did spec I would have used the, uh, plus, the plus two to hit for him. It's just one shot now, I have to do it before I roll, so... So how many, so it's one command point and he gets plus two to his hit yeah, rolls, right? one command point, right. Alright, because he normally only hits on fours? No, he normally hits on uh, threes, but... So I it gives him plus two to that? Yeah. Huh, interesting. So, it, which is good because he obscured, makes yeah. it a two again. So he's got one shot, hit on yeah. a two. Hitting on a two. Yeah. And then um, winning on a three. Yeah. Strength ten, toughness seven. It's a hit. Yeah. Now I don't think I'll, yeah, I don't get any cover against that. It's, my, yeah, it's minus four, you do d6 damage, minimum three. So, so you do four. four. My rugged construction ignores them on sixes. <laughs> this is uh, familiar. So I lose four of them. On top of that, you use a stratagem. Yep. And because my Nexos and Clavicus are here on a five plus, I get a command point. Oh, come on, I only get to do it once per round with the new match play rules. Let me have one. And this rock grinder's down to six wounds. Firing the heavy stubber, hitting on twos because of the plus two. Okay. And then wounding on threes against the neophytes. So we've got three wounds. Unfortunately, I won't get cover because a few guys in the back aren't within an inch of the barricades. So we've got a five up armor. Oh. Huh. Oh. Well then. Not close enough to the Acolyte Icon Ward to get the six up, ignoring wounds. And let's just try it again, minus the uh, stratagem. Yeah. D three shots. Oh, and by the way, it was two. yeah. Because I said, oh, because good thing with the obscured, but you weren't obscured in that rock grinder. Doesn't matter, anyways. D three shots. Whoop. Three. Three. Time. But hitting on threes because it's no stratagem. Okay. Do you get to reroll the one? No, no. There. Threes to wound. And then d6 each, minimum three. I've only got six wounds left, so unless you roll really low, yeah, it's nine. Six up to ignore it, I need to roll four sixes. Yeah. Is it blow up on a six? No. Goodbye, Rock Grinder! And that's first strike, oh wait, no, there's no first strike in this one. It's win or lose. Then Heavy Stubber hitting on fours, because of the obscurity, and threes to wound. Uh, one wound. One. Five up armor against that as well. One more dice. You, sir. Next up, we got Grav going into the Neophytes, who will be obscured from them. So you got 15 shots. Now they normally hit on what? Fours, so, so down to fives. fives yeah. Fives, you're rolling ones. Reroll ones because of the Dominus nearby. That's yeah. why they're throwing everything into them. Okay. Reroll those three ones. Well, that's a lot of fours, though. Yeah, it is a lot of fours. You, obscured, oh, you only no. got two hits. Look at all those. Oh, there's a five. Yeah. Look at all those misses because oh. of that. Threes to wound. These are good. Oh, okay. okay. These are minus three AP. But I have hard cover, so my five up becomes three up, then becomes six up. Yep. No, I got an acolyte icon ward to ignore it on a six. Oh, one dies. So far. Oh, then you got your phosphor guys which ignore yep. cover. It's not rapid fire, so one shot each hitting on fives. Okay. Threes to wound. And no boo, okay. The breachers plasma into them. Do they also have no, the phosphor? It's, it's not plasma. It's it's arc. But oh, they're arc. No, they they have they have a close combat weapon instead of the secondary I shooting see. weapon. So just the arc stuff. The arc rifles, yeah. Uh, five gears, so fives to hit. Now that's oh, better. still three hits. Strength six. Yep. So twos to wound. Twos. Okay. So three wounds. What's the AP on this? Minus two. So my three up from heavy cover yeah, becomes a five up because they don't ignore cover no. anything. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, that's D3 damage. You could still kill one. There's two wounds on each of them. Yeah. Yeah, you killed okay. one. And one of them dies. Other breachers, same yeah. thing. Hitting on fives. <laughs> Reroll ones. You got two hits. Look again with all those fours. <laughs> Hold on, was there? There was two hits, yeah. Yeah. So many fours. The game is mocking you. Three's so to wound. Two's to wound. Two's to wound. Yeah. And then I get my five up saves. Again. Ooh, hey. saved one. D3 damage. Can you still kill one, though? Is... The verdict is no. no. Unless you want to reroll. Okay. Not really. Okay. <laughs> well, then you're down to a one. Yeah. And then this squad will fire into the same neophyte squad from before. Yeah. Not obscured though. From that hey. angle, you can see them a lot better. The so now, I'll, so I'll, now naturally, I'll roll no fours. Yeah, yeah. Just fives oh, and sixes. Yeah. No, no. Oh, there's yeah. a lot of fours. Oh yeah. Threes to wound. Right. Strength five. Ugh. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. I get six <laughs> up saves against yep. these. And then ignoring them on sixes. Oh, 
I'm not allowed to ignore wounds. Two, three. Ah, sorry, buddy. Four. Phosphor. And the phosphor hitting on uh, fours. Now we roll ones. ones. There weren't a lot of ones. No, there haven't so been. Far, yeah. Threes. Uh, yeah. Ignoring their cover at minus uh, one. So six up saves. Six up ignoring wounds thanks to the icon ward. Jeez, I, it's two games in a row, man. I can't make my six ups. And yes, I did make two six ups this game. It was on the Goliath, where it wasn't enough to keep it alive. And the Rangers will unload everything into the heavy weapon squad as well. 12 galvanic rifles, minus one to hit because it's yep. obscured. So you're hitting on fours or yep. fives? Fours now. Skitari hate better than servers. They uh, better. No rerolling. What's the strength of these? Uh, four, so three. threes. Now, sixes would be. Yeah, okay, so one with minus one. The rest is just. Or minus nothing? No AP, yeah. So, so no AP ones I get a three up against with yeah. my hard cover. Okay. So one dies, and this one I get a four up against. Saved. So the one wound does finish this guy off. Two rapid firing arc rifles hitting on fours. Uh, four. Oh, oh look. Okay, great. Yeah. Awesome. Plasma caliber. Supercharged. You want to supercharge it? Yeah, I don't just care. Just so you if can you do the two damage thing. Yeah. It's because it's minus one to hit. Oh, oh of yeah, course you don't roll any ones or twos. <laughs> Twos. Twos. Boom. And the AP minus three, right? Yeah. yeah. Six up save. I gotta roll double six. No. Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Vanguard right here. What is their target? Yeah, I'll put everything to the bikes squad there. So the bikes with the quad? Yeah. Are you gonna do the plasma first? Supercharge it? Yeah. You're minus two to hitting them. Because minus one because they have the skilled writer's rule, and then minus one because they're obscured. So you'll die on three. Okay, fine, minus. I won't super you won't. Oh, no, you, I think you should die with No. Oh, well, that's fine, well. I'm not going to roll any ones here, so, yeah, yeah, so yeah, then yeah, I yeah. regret my decision. Look, I rolled no one. Uh, oh, it would have been one. That would have killed yeah. one. That would have killed one. So you're hitting on uh, fives because of minus fives, two, right? Minus yeah. two. Strength? A seven, so three. Threes, because their toughness is four. Yeah, that is one. One. So the one in the back is wounded down to one. Fire. Arc rifle rapid firing, hitting on fives. Uh, One hit. Okay. Th uh, threes because strength six. So, uh, yes. Uh, yes. AP? Minus one. So then I, with. There's no cover, so six up safe. No. Okay. So. So we got the rad shots. Now, I should point out the rules is written, we should roll these one at a time. Because if you roll a six to wound, there are two damage instead of one. Yeah. And I have two wounds on each of these. Right. But there's 18 shots, so I'll just do the sixes first, okay? <laughs> I'd rather do that than watch you roll these one at a time. Okay, so... Fives to hit. Fives, because jackals. Okay. And then fives to wound. Yep. Sixes are special. Uh, oh, just only one. one. Do the one six. There's no AP, so no. five up. Kill one. Five up. Kill another, and a half. Wait. So two of them die, and I'll put one wound on the... I'll actually put a... Wound. No, I'm gonna keep him alive. I'll, I'll lose my leader eventually to keep the quad alive. He had an alpha there too. We've got to fire fives yeah, to hit. Right. Okay. Well, it's your fault if you roll sixes to wound now. I'm, <laughs> I'm not gonna retrospectively no. go back. Okay, here we go. Last squad. We got two arc rifles going into that little neophyte squad and the torsion cannon into the jackals. What are we gonna start with? Uh, torsion cannon here. One so shot. Fives to hit because it's minus one to shoot them. Blue. So then four shots from the heavy arc rifles. Five. Oh, hit it on fives. Three roll ones. Three roll ones, yeah. I look hey, it's a hit. Threes to wound? Or yeah. twos to wound? Uh, twos to wounds, Chris strength six. Yes. AP? And mine is two. So, so they minus. passed. Eradication array from the Dominus into the same squad. D3, D3 shots. shots. Two, two shots, but he moved. Yep. So They're obscured. So Excuse fours. Me. Fours to hit. Uh, one, one hit. hit. Two is Chris strength six. Uh, AP? Yeah. Minus two. So five up. No minus. Uh, Doesn't matter. Yeah. That, well, is there a minus at all? Yeah, it is minus two. I'm okay. 100%. And then how much damage? Just one. So six up to ignore it? No. Whew. So Search phase. Into the four jackals here. Overwatch. Eight auto pistol shots. Woo! Six is to hit. Nada. Charge. Uh, they made it. 12 inches. Oh, wow. Uh, measure it, man. <laughs> measure it. In they go. Surely I'll put them like. Yeah, you don't really need to go 12 inches. Maybe I'll put him to Which one's wounded? Uh, this one here at the end. Okay. No other charges? For, we're going to go to the fight phase now. Them starting against the jackals. Good my jackals. Good my jackals. Cord claws first, hitting on threes. Threes re-rolling because of the uh, omniscient mask next to them. Uh, so I'll hit them. The six is D3 mortal wounds. Let's resolve that no, first. No, no, it's two wound. It's oh, two it's two wound. Yeah. So strength? Uh, four. So four is to wound. Six is do D3 mortal wounds, so go ahead and start with that. D3 mortal wounds. Three. Three. 
And then these are AP nothing, nothing so, so five up. So that's another D3 damage. It doesn't matter, it'll just kill the next one. Because three mortal wounds kills one and a half, and then you do D3 damage to that one, so it finishes them off. And then the rest of their weapons hit on threes. Oh no, I gotta do the stupid uh, prime separately again, because he's strength five and... Okay, threes uh, to hit. Um, Three hits, threes yep. to wound. Sixes uh, do mortal wound. Uh, so A mortal wound. wound. And then the rest of them hit on threes. Yep. Rerolling those two fails. Okay. Fours to wound. Uh, oh, just one. one. If I fail this five up, another one dies. Huh. Uh, do you have any extra weapons? Or is that it? Wasn't expecting to survive that. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll fight back. Get them all cultist knives, and there's the leader in there, so I got five attacks in total. Hitting on fours, wounding on fours. Huh. huh. Can you imagine if I killed one? Uh, that'd be What's your save? Four up? Yep, four up. You got one wound left in the guy? Huh. That'd be pretty huh. cool, right? Huh. Yeah. Well, hey. okay. Forward. Yeah, sure. can't complain. Can't complain. So Battle shock time. I only lost two there. They're leadership eight, so we're fine. I lost eight over here, though. So um, I lose d6 more. But here's the fun part. My Cult Creed, if I fail a Battleshock test, I lose half rounded up. So what I need to roll is a one or a two, and then only one of them will run away. If I roll three, two will run away. Now I'm close to the Icon Ward, so I get two chances at this. I need to look at a one or a two. Yeah, all right. So only one runs away. Um, obviously the leader. Let's keep the Flamer alive. That's the end of your first turn. So how do you feel about your progress? You feel um, good? Well, um... Have you up in Team Ted? Neophyte squad mostly dead. Yeah. Killed some guys over here. I, I should I should pretty much focus Rock on grinder. your... I should pretty much focus on your neophytes, because they are the ones that um, hold your objectives, right? Because I have a lot of troops, too. So if I kill your troops, then it's a you lot easier... You just jump easier. up there and it's I can't win. It's a lot easier for me to get your objectives, yeah. So yeah. that's what I kind of did, maybe? I mean, it's not really much in sight, or not obscured. That's so. true. That's tough to say. You definitely have the advantage, like with positioning here, which is a. I really like is that the point, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. It's for the point. So you, you have the advantage of the pro preliminary bombardment and infinite yeah. army size. True. And I have the advantage of uh, you have to basically really beat me to win. So we'll see. We'll see, turn two for Gene to the call. What's your new canticle? Yeah, uh, I'll choose the reroll ones to hit in sh for shooting. Canticle. Shooting, so for this turn, got it. I'm gonna spend a command point to reinforce this group of neophytes. First off on a five plus, I'll get a command point for using a stratagem. Yay, it worked! So it basically got refunded. Oh, I wish that was my roll for how many I'm getting back. I get D6 back. One, 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 one. Three, okay. I'll keep it. So I'll bring back a regular dude, a flamer, and my leader. My jackals here are going to fall back. Hey guys, my name is Speed, Hello. and his name is Bump. Together we form, I don't know, Bump Speed. Primus is going to advance three. He's gonna run around to here to provide his reroll one bubble as much as he can. And then I'm just gonna have these guys poke their heads out right here. He becoming obscured. Uh, Magus, Ooh, this will be dangerous bringing him out here. But I need to be able to see these guys. These jackals right here will advance, ooh, 20 inches. So I measured this beforehand and brought me to this crack. Here they come! <laughs> I'm jackals, see, get it. This Magus will come up here. Hmm. And the squad of neophytes will come up here, making sure to stay obscured. My Clavicus will advance, three. He's just gonna come to here. This Neophyte squad will move up, like so. Another one down here will advance three inches. So basically gonna do that to have them come up. Not all of them are gonna get up there, but thankfully we got six inch vertical coherency to help us out. Uh, I'm gonna keep the grenade launchers down below. Yeah, I was hoping to roll high enough to get them all up there, away from the dragoons. And these neophytes are just going to 
You know what? They're going to tuck back over here. You know what? I'm going to advance them. I don't have anything to shoot at. 12 inches. That'll allow me to bring the squad over here. i got to stay away from table edges now. So once I start killing your units, they could be coming back. The troops especially, which is the majority of your army. They come back on two pluses. Goliath Rock Grinder number one. And Goliath Rock Grinder number two. His name is Road. Block. Hence, Block Road. Yeah. And then Quad Bike. We'll just go over here. And these two are going to pull back to right here. Keller Morph arrives more than nine inches away, but within 12 inches of infantry. You have a two command point stratagem you could use to fire, but unfortunately for you, I place him in such a way that only this guy can see him. So you'd only have one guy shooting at minus two, because minus one for the stratagem and minus one for obscured. Would you like to spend two command points to have him shoot? Well, what can he see? Can he he can see, see him, point? so he can fire at the squad. No, I won't bother. You won't bother? No. Okay. Time for some Psychic. Magus here is going to do Smite, I hope. Five plus, I got it. D3 mortal wounds. Oh. I kill one and a half of them. <laughs> so one dies. Ouchie, ouchie. Oh. Nip. Yep. And then we'll Smite the Dragoons as well, because hey, why not? I need six now. Ah, I got six. Didn't have to do any rerolls. Hey, three mortal wounds. Take it. So he's down. Tedos. Shooting phase. Let's start with my Keller Morph. Going to be firing here. Now you are obscured to me, so I'll only be hitting on threes. That does make a big difference. So he's got three pistols. One of them be the Relic. The Relic I don't have to roll separately because it only rerolls wounds against characters, but it does get an extra shot. You are obscured, so I'm hitting you on threes. Oh, the two twos! So then I get four more shots. Okay, well, when I said 10 to 12 auto, uh, average hits, I got six. Fives to wound, strength four. Yep. Oh, garbage. You get a six up save against this. It's minus two, and then I have height advantage, and you're three up. In bone. No. So, two damage. Dang it. Well, that was my fault for placing him somewhere that he was obscured. I wanted to keep him alive because you had a stratagem that you could fire at him when he showed up. These two will fire at him at minus one. They can fall back and shoot, thanks to my cult creed. Four auto pistols, fives to hit. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Fives to wound. Hey, can we do it? Three up save. Maybe. Three up save. Maybe. Three up save. Oh. oh well, whatever. Then we're gonna put two flamers into them. Two auto guns into them. Rapid fire auto guns. Fours to hit. No. Oh, fives to wound. Yay! Height advantage because it minus one, so you got a four up save. Which I do. Oh, you the Dancing Matthews are, are betraying me. Two flamers, oh sorry. Did I say two flamers in the dragons? Yeah, yeah, you okay, did. I did. That was what I want to do. Ten auto hits. Uh, fives to wound? Yep. Nice. Height, height advantage, I'm firing down at the cockpit, so minus one to your, what, four up? Uh, four up save. So, so five, five up. up. Yeah, that's right. Three good. wounds. So Finishes off one, can it blow up? It can, so let's see if that happens. On, on a six. six. It's one more wound. Uh, it no. Is, it's not. Both Goliaths are going to try to incinerate him, and they'll put the heavy stubbers into this squad. Okay. So two clearance uh, incinerators, 2d6 shots each. Nice. Oh. 16. Fives to wound, minus, oh, there's one. Oh, there's two. Wow, that's still crappy. Minus one to each of those, so you get a four up armor save. Ooh. Maybe you'll fail one. Hey. Wow. Two heavy stubbers into them. We're finishing that guy off. So six shots of the heavy stubbers hitting on fives because I moved. And then wounding on fives. No. Flamers into him. Auto guns into them. Whoosh. Ooh, nine. Fives to wound. Hey, four wounds. Height advantage makes it minus one, so you got five up saves. If you fail all these, you die. Oh, I got one wound left. Well, his job is obvious now. Yep, what, run into Overwatch? Yep, run into Overwatch. <laughs> Dies and come back. <laughs> and then the auto guns. Nine shots, because one's in rapid fire, hitting on fours. Rerolling ones. Fives to wound, AP minus one, because of height advantage. Hmm, oh. three wounds. Fail a single four up save, man. You could do it. I believe in you. Hey, you did too. Well, that's overkill, but thanks. You're such a keener. Put in the torsion gun. You really don't care about the guy. Uh, yeah. He looks so cool. Let's do my, uh, these two guys into your rest stalkers. We're just trying to get you down to one. 
with one wound. <laughs> Got the flamer first. Ooh, six auto hits. Strength five, so threes to wound. Uh-oh, it might be too effective. Minus one. So what's your five up or four up? Yep. Oh, look, look at all Oh, no, I might finish you off. No, I don't want to kill you. <laughs> no, uh, don't, you die. Yes. No, I still have two auto pistols. No, wait, I'll leave not the prime. Oh, no, they don't run. <laughs> I declared it, so the auto pistols. Woo, they missed. I'm not re-rolling. Uh. I don't think I could anyways, but if I could, I wouldn't. <laughs> My mortars are going to shoot at the rangers. 3d6 shots. Mm, not bad, 11. Four is to hit. <laughs> uh, nope, they are not well, the one that I declared to hold the cash. I, I had I told Constant afterwards that I mean for the missile launcher guys to be holding the ammo cache. Three is to wound. Yeah, height advantage though, minus one. Do I kill one? Four up, save. Four up. Or is it five up now? Uh, five up. Whatever, he's dead. Yeah. <whistles> Boom! Might as well toss some frag missiles from these guys into your vanguard. 3d6 shots, eh, 11. Four is to hit. Rerolling ones. Okay, turn a crappy roll into a good one. Ah, crappy into average. Threes to wound. These are minus one. You got hard cover, so you got two up, reduced to three up. Let's see. One dies. Which one dies? Sorry, bro. And then this squad of neophytes will fire at them as well. We're gonna do crack grenades though, because I just really want to punch through a couple. Assuming they hit, of course. Fours. Nope. They're, they don't have the ammo cache. And then the auto guns, fours to hit, fours to wound, two wounds with the minus one AP thanks to the height advantage, so you got a three up save from them as well. And one more dice. Oh right, I forgot the last guns from the missile teams. Hitting on fours. Oh, they'll hit fours to wound. Oh, they'll wound. Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, forget the frag good. missiles. Last guns, everybody. Three up saves. Ha, huh, <laughs> another one. So three oh, frag no. missiles did as much damage as three last guns. Got morale on him, he lost three of his compatriots. So obviously I'm looking for a four. More. Yeah, you want him to run. If you four plus, he runs. I can't no. see. He stays. You want to spend a command point and reroll it? Mm. <laughs> You're not considering it. <laughs> is it worth one guy? Well, is it worth ten guys is the question. I don't know. Well, eventually they'll come back. The problem is, well, here. The thing is, one, um, first off, I have to roll a four up for them. They're not infantry? They're not troops, I mean? They're not troops, no. Oh, so they, they okay, I was thinking they're troops. No, I don't have every, not everything. I don't know, I felt like everything was troops. <laughs> they're troops, no. Um, um, so all that just to maybe get them back. And then a six, one in six, then a one in five chance, uh, or no, five out of six chance. That you're that way back here, at the end of your movement phase. Anyways. All right, then just keep them. Yeah, sure. He lost, oh, they only lost one. He lost two there. What's their leadership? Seven? Plus three there, so but Oh three. Uh, but they're plus one, so eight because of the um, Okay. Data so a six there. another one runs. Yeah. No. Okay. Good. And leadership seven right here, so losing one does not matter. And leadership seven at least there. So leadership eight. Eight plus so it, one, so Yeah, you're fine. Well, I can't really complain about that too much. I did pretty well. Knocked him down to one wound, knocked that guy down to one wound. I'm kind of disappointed that I only killed one of them with my Keller Morph. I didn't even kill one of them with my Keller Morph, actually. I'm disappointed by that especially. But, you know, I chose to put him in an obscured area. That actually cost me two of the first hits, which is two more potential hits. In my second roll, for the extra hits, I rolled some more twos. Would have probably killed the one wound guy? I probably, no, yeah. I could have killed maybe yeah. two of them. Who knows? But yeah. I, know, I know he's more a character hunter, but I didn't see any good spots to go after your characters. So it's fine. So that's the end of my turn as we go into Adeptus Mechanicus turn two. Movement! So he's, sorry, I gotta turn him around because of that's his fine. lance. We, we've already said that even though his lance is too tall, yeah, he can go underneath small. there. The one rest stalker, where's he going? Hey, Flamer. Hello, oh, <laughs> hello, friend. <laughs> I don't have to overwatch you, though. I could just let them die. So now you're going to spend a command point to see if they can be Batman. Yep. They're going to use the grapple launchers. Grapple. Now, we already measured everything. He needs to roll two for the advance to be able to yep. get up to here. But I'm hoping for a three, three, preferably a four. Yeah. Then I can just plop Get them all up them there, there. Do some yep. good shooting. So, because, yeah, as fast as possible, I guess. And they get hard cover, even. Yep. Two, so. Do it. <laughs> Uh, well, two. Mm -hmm. You can basically teeter the four at the front on there with Wobbly Model, and the rest will have to be down here. You want to reroll it? I think this is actually a situation where a reroll would be um, uh, dangerous, but no, but worth I think it. it would be worth it. Okay. Yeah. I don't have a way to get me more command points this turn. Yeah, four. So You're all on. Bats, Guitaria. Engines here. Hello, Just stay nearby. Here. Yeah, here. Hello, Just engines here, my friend. 
So um, he would move. Big bad there. bully. And the big bully number two. Big bad bully number two would move eight inches through there. He will go for bump speed. Where are you going? You afraid of bump speed? <laughs> bump speed. Five inches. I'm moving out of cover. Infiltrators will have appeared here. We'll infiltrate to here. With all their fleshette blasters. So in the shooting phase, they're going to fire, and you're spending a command point on the stratagem that gives them plus one to their hit rolls. Yep. And that's called? Uh, it's the Protector Doctrine Imperative. So Plasma first. I'm supercharging it because... Because uh, I'm two wounds each? Yeah, and I'm reeling ones anyway. So we need to roll them separate then. Uh, yeah, I guess. Because each could kill. So uh, that is a hit, hit. And? And that is a hit, hit. Okay. Strength, there's twos to wound because yep. of strength eight. Yep. Uh, we got Aww. two ones there, but these are AP minus three. Yeah. So my five up becomes a three up, becomes a six yeah, up. You, yeah. Two die. You're fine. You're going to kill the rest of the rad stuff. Twelve shots of the rad carbines hitting on threes. You're all those three ones. Because of your yep. canticle. We need on fours, but fours. sixes are two wounds each. Yep. So there's our two right there. There's no AP to these, so I got a three up save thanks to hard cover. And you got them. Yeah, so do, this June Crawler will shoot into the front. Um, it's an obscured Goliath, yeah. so you'll be hitting on fours. Yep, the new is into there. The heavy, the one heavy stubber will go into those neophytes down there. Oh, these ones, one, so yeah. this squad. Yeah. Are you going to use your stratagem mm. to get plus I already two? used it for them. Oh, that's the same stratagem. Yep, it's for Skitari Eye, and there's... Oh, okay, got spirit. it. Yeah. So it's D3 shots. D3. One hitting on a four. Yep. You're rolling ones. Ooh, okay. threes to wound. Threes to wound. Uh, D6 damage, because I don't have cover there. Um, three. Three minimum, yeah. which I ignore on sixes, thanks to rugged construction. Hey, I ignored one. Two wounds. And then the heavy stubbers into them. So, obscured. So two, obscured, so yeah, fours, so obscured, so fours four. to hit. Uh, one. And then threes uh, to wound. Threes, uh, yes. With my five up save. Saved. Hey. Same thing. Yeah. Same target, also obscured. D3 shots. Uh, three. Ooh, three shots. Fours to hit. Two hits, three roll ones. Yep. Thanks to your canticle. Nope. Three's to wound. You could kill him with this. Could. You might. D6 each. Minimum three. It's only got eight wounds um, left. So oh, we've got six. six. Well, you know what? It's yeah. nice that they're minimum three. No, yeah, I like is, that. that very nice. Otherwise, that one and two would be super yeah, frustrating. Yeah, six is to ignore it. I would ignore one of them. It's down to three. And then the heavy stubber into them again. Five's to hit. Uh, four's to hit. Oh, but, sorry. Four's yeah, to hit. Yeah. with three up. Three's here. to wound. Uh, yep. Five up safe. One more die, or one dies. Yeah. I'll kill one at the bottom, but the one that's further away. Next up, we've got these guys. The grab weapons are going to go into that same w injured Goliath, the injured one. and, and the then the phosphor, phosphor into these guys. Yeah. Rapid fire the phosphor to fours this time on them because yes. they're not obscured, but they're minus one to hit because they're skilled riders. Right. So five so to five, hit. Five, roll ones. ones. Oh. So three hits, strength five, so on threes. threes. Please uh, ignore cover, but I don't have any anyways. Minus one. So six, six up. Hey, good one. Yeah. Finish off this jackal. Fifteen grab shots hitting on fours. No fives because fives of the secured. This yeah. is into the Goliath rock grinder. Rerolling those little ones. But it's a lot more. Hey, not fives bad. Now. Six, six hits so far. Oh, Seven, eight, nine oh, hits. Woo. Fives to wound. Fives to wound now. Yeah. Um, so Ooh, four. Not of them. bad. And these are minus three. Minus three. I don't get a save. So they're just one wound each. D3, actually. No, because I don't only have oh, yeah. four up no, no, save. No, right. yeah. They do D3 damage to things that have a three yeah, up yeah, save. Yeah. So one damage each. I ignore them on sixes. Uh, okay. So one more. Uh, and he dies. He had three wounds left. Does he blow up on a six? No. Goodbye, rock grinder number two. Oh. So these three are going to fire at this squad. Yeah. The grab into them. They, two of them are out in the open, so they're not obscured. Yep. Hit on fours. <laughs> Oh, you only got two fours. Now you only get two. Oh, three fours. Yeah. It's because you rolled so well. Threes to wound. Threes. Oh, oh, oh. Minus three. Yep. So I get a six up save thanks to my hardcover. <laughs> and then I ignore it on sixes. Hey. Oh, yeah, no you bad. just killed seven instead of all of them. Hmm. Well, I'll kill those flamers if it means going back in such a way that your next squad cannot see them any longer. So that was four, five. Six, seven. We'll keep the leader alive, obviously. The phosphor still get to shoot, though, hitting on fours. Yep. Wait, wait, were they in rapid fire? I gotta check. Yes, they're in rapid fire. So, six shots. Yep. Hitting on fours. Indeed. 
Okay. We roll ones. Ugh. Hey! Oh. Okay. Three's to wound. But well, they're not going to die then, I guess. Oh, one. no. And six no AP? Eight, uh, minus one ignoring cover. So six up. Yeah. Hey. Six up. Hey. Six up. Six up. Okay. Hey! hey. Yeah, no, he still dies. We got your vanguard next, everything except the pistol and the rifle into these Adelan jackals, and then those two into this Adelan yep. jackal. You're gonna supercharge the plasma? You only live once anyways, right? You're right, and... Minus one to hit him, though. I want to kill this guy. Yeah. No, you know what? Let me start with the arc pistol. So, <laughs> Just because in case. Might, I might you don't have to declare the overcharge until you go to roll it, right? Right, so... Four is to hit. Reroll uh, ones. Reroll ones, because you're a canticle. No! Great. So yes. Overcharge! Ones or twos, you're dead. Oh, oh come on, man! You, you, all the risk, no, all no risk, all reward. Threes to wound. Uh, two, twos, twos to wound. Strength eight now. Okay, yeah. I can't save yeah. that. He's dead. That's four wounds in total. Awesome. The galvanic rifles into the other Adelan jackals. It's actually the galvanic rifles and the arc rifles because they're they, all the same kind of stuff. Strength five, strength six. No, no. Yeah, yeah. And I'm toughness four. Yeah, yeah, but but they, I, I forgot they have different different, different range. So yeah. Oh, okay. Galvanic rifles. Fours to hit because of minus one to shoot. Yeah. Them, not from obscure, okay. but because of their skilled writers. And then four is two wound, because strength four. AP? Uh, minus one on this Six one. up. Take a wound. And then the arc rifles? Yep. Three, uh, four is to hit. Uh, Reroll roll ones. This one here. Uh, yes. yes. Strength? Uh, six, so on the threes. Three. AP? No. Oh, never mind. The one in the back. And then who's going to fire at them next? Those guys into them. I'll start with the. No, you know what? Hmm. Torsion yeah. cannon to the rock grinder, arc rifle to them. Arc rifle, hitting on five. Five, because you're minus one, right? Yeah, yeah. You're four, oh. you're four base. And uh, one hit. Strength? Uh, six, so, so three. Oh no, yeah, yeah, six, so three's to wound. AP? No, uh, never mind. Torsion! On a five, uh, four, actually, because he's not obscured. No, he's not 50% not obscured as a vehicle okay, needs to be. Hit. Strength? Eight, so one to three, right? Threes, yeah, toughness seven. AP? Uh, four, actually. I don't get a save. What's the, what's the damage? It's a melter without melter. So it's D6, D6 damage. damage. Uh, five! five. Which I ignore in sixes. Hey! Oh. Only three. Right. Boop. And then obscured, but still gonna try anyways. Dominus into them. So D3 shots. From the eradication ray. Will he eradicate you, hopefully? Two shots. Two hitting shots. on fours, because we moved. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, hit on fives. He moved, so three. Obscured, so four. Bikes, so fives. Uh. Never mind, not as scared. Hitting on fours. Yeah. Uh, hey, I made a bad difference. On a three, because strength six. Uh, AP? Two. Okay, it kills him. It killed one! Woo! And so then your. Monster Serpent Serpentine now. Um, uh, we roll ones. ones. Uh, okay, yeah, that's a hit. And strength? on three, because strength five. AP? Uh, minus one. Six up. Hey. Good job, buddy. The next group of arc rifles into this small neophyte squad were obscured. So it's so just five. five. <laughs> again. Uh, Three roll ones. Uh, the you know, if you were Steve, the you wouldn't mind this at all because you'd be making all your hits anyways. Yep. Oh, this is my existence. Oh. <laughs> Three is to wound. No two is because strength six. But sure. Yeah, sure. Minus two. Uh, so five up with my heart. Hey, hey alive! Woo! <laughs> Flechette blasters! You can do it! Lots of flechette blasters hitting on 20, or there's 25 shots hitting on what, threes? Hitting on threes, reeling ones. Yeah, not obscured. Yeah, good thing. So, um. Uh, hey. Ooh, I don't see any twos in there, buddy. You got 24 to 25 hits. Fours to wound. No AP, obviously, because exactly, exactly. it's like shotguns, basically. Yeah. Fours. Uh, okay. You did 10 wounds to a 10 man squad, but I got a 5 up save. Okay. Eight die. So I'm gonna keep my leader pew, pew, pew. and one grenade launcher. Uh, I'm gonna lose d6 divided by two. <laughs> Let's see if they can only roll one or two. Yeah, Does your rest stalker want to charge? Oh yeah, the rest stalker definitely. Oh, hold on, hold on. I will, I will oblige will. and overwatch. Okay. Incinerator. Six auto hits. He's only got one wound left. Oh wow, Matt, that's very. Threes to wound. Can you make that many five ups? If I make that many five ups, actually, I'm proud of him. He's dead. Oh, you, you got your wish. You tried, buddy. <laughs> and then he wants to charge the rock grinder. Sure. Overwatch. Yeah. Best and kill you with the heavy stubber. Hits. Wounds. Don't. <laughs> Don't. Four up. 
Oh, oh how I'm embarrassing! How Hold on, does oh. he blow up? He could do a mortal oh, yeah, to me on a six. Just roll. Just roll. And we'll, we'll measure after. No, I, I'm not gonna spend one coup. Oh, oh, we wanna auto blow him up? Oh, no. no. It's yeah. just one more move. Just roll it, roll it, roll it. No. No. Oh, that was embarrassing, man. Yeah, I know. I, I'm like, you know what? Oh. Save the Prometheum. Hit him with the heavy stubber. Going for a long bomb charge, finish those two off, and also get closer to the objective. You'll need yeah, a nine inch charge. Uh, you close. Eight. But no. You gonna go for the reroll? Sure. Why not, right? Command we got, points. We got, we're both sitting yeah. on a lot of command points. No. No. If you're wondering why I'm not using Nexus's uh, ability to try to get more command points, it's because you only get one back per battle round, and I already got one back this battle round. At this squad right here, lost eight of its guys. Yeah. It's leadership eight. Yeah, leadership eight. So, if I, so basically, I'm going to lose d6 more, divided by two, thanks to my yep. cult creeds. I need to roll a one or a two, and I can re-roll it thanks to the icon horde. Five. Three. They're both run, because it's rounded up, it says. I'm going to spend two command points to keep them alive. Ha-ha! <laughs> you killed one from this squad. That's not enough there. Leadership eight. And you killed one jackal here. Leadership... S no, it's leadership eight as well, so they're not running. So beginning of my turn, I'm going to spend a command point to bring d6 of them back. Three of them, and on a five plus, I get that command point back. Nope. Go a nade launcher and two regular guys. And you're choosing a new canticle to reroll failed morale test for the yeah. rest of this battle round. Yeah, don't want to lose guys. Okay. Movement. My color morph is going to come up to here. Staying obscured, but not being obscured. I'm annoying 50 something point character. I just. With way too many pistol shots. Yeah. The Megas will come to here, getting them to be the nearest. These guys are going to shuffle. And he'll come around back here. Flamer up. So two flamers are in range. Oh, wait, and then he's going to loop all the way over to here. And then my Magus is going to come all the way over to here. Jackals! <laughs> oh, these guys are so annoying. Ten points of model. Totally worth it. They don't have to do anything except just... Block. The cost of two neophytes for one on a bike. I'm going to advance these neophytes three inches. So they're just going to hop up here. The grenade launcher's out front. My Goliath will just drive out here. These neophytes will just move up to here, allowing their buddies down on the ground to get up as well. Wish they had flamers. And this quad is gonna come over through there. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom, vroom. And these two bikes are just gonna drive up here. And I'm going to advance my Clavicus an inch. He's just gonna drop down to here. Providing his 12 inch bubble of no, you cannot come in right here. Just make sure my two grenade launchers can see your vanguard over there. Actually, the Primus will come over to here as well. Yeah, you know what, let's just do it. Hacklite Icon Ward is going to tuck in more here to keep that bubble of re-rolling sixes going. Psychic Phase, Smite. Need a five plus. Get a seven, so D3 die. Three die! Just take my Arcane Bolt more. <laughs> yeah, Arcane Bolt is way nicer, right? And then we're going to smite this squad, but only a six. I get an eight. I do only one Mortal Wound, bringing that one down to one. If I had killed it, I would have left the other one. Well, let's try to finish him off. Um, well, you know what? These flamers are only in range of that, so two flamers and the auto gun. 2d6 auto hits with the flamers. Fives to wound with height advantage. Ooh, just one, but height advantage brings your three up save to a four up. Let's finish him off. Ah. Rapid fire auto gun hitting on fours. No, not rerolling ones. Wounding on fives, nothing. Auto pistol, auto pistol, auto pistol. Really, they're two auto pistols each. Fours to hit. Fives to wound. You get your full three up save against these. So obviously now. So obviously this is where you're gonna fail. Oh, you're alive. Okay, let's do it really uh, annoyingly. Well, you know what? Both their auto pistols. Fours to hit. Fives to wound. One wound. That's with height advantage. You get a four up save. Booyah! See you later, tensor thingy. Keller Morph is gonna unload his pistols into the ones in the back. Seven shots hitting on twos. Oh come on! Two ones. Five hits. Five more shots. Okay, so nine, nine hits. Fives to wound. 
Okay, that's pretty good. This is minus three. Minus two normally, then minus an extra one because of height advantage. So you get your six up in Yeah. Two damage each. So no, 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 kills, no. Uh, one and That'll kill two of them. So two yeah. damage, then two damage, then two damage, then Ow. two damage. Ow. Let's fire at these guys with crack grenades. I did advance, so I'm hitting on fives. Okay. Or not at all. Tress mortars into these uh, rangers. 3d6 shots. Ooh, 13. Hitting on fours. Threes to wound. So three wounds with the AP minus one thanks to height advantage, so you get a five up save. Okay. And two die. Boom, boom. Hey, take the two out of range. There you go. He's These guys are in range to use grapple launch just to get up here. And we're going to toss a couple frag grenades into them as well. And then we're going to rapid fire the rest into them. Frag grenades, ten shots. Hitting on fours. Oh, okay. Sorry, they're controlling the objective. Was there two ones in there? There was two ones in there, not three. And then wounding on fours, only strength three. But they do have height advantage, so minus one, so you get a five up save. Two more. Oh, five more die! Oh, God. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Okay. So, three, four. How do you choose which ones? All the weapons five. are useful. Yeah, I chose to get him so that they can both. They can get up there easier. Get up there easier. Let's rapid fire the auto guns. Fours to hit. You know what? I'm gonna do half of these obscured. So at least it's no more than that, but at least we fives to hit re-rolling ones. So we got three hits so yeah. far. <laughs> fours to hit re-rolling ones. Okay. And then fours to wound. No height advantage, you've got hard cover, so you're looking at a two-up save right now. So no ones. No you're good. ones. Might as well toss my needle pistol in there. He misses. Ah, oh, he rerolls ones, because yeah. he is the warlord. Misses. And then the squad will fire frag grenades and auto guns. And I'll throw an actual, I'll replace one of the auto guns and throw a blasting charge. Yeah. So we're going to 2d6, so this is 3d6 grenades essentially. So okay. 12. We'll throw in the auto guns at the same time because they're all the same strength in AP. Four is to hit rerolling ones because the primus is nearby. Oh, yeah, good thing. <laughs> Four is to wound and then you get a two up save. Ah, okay. oh, maybe you'll fail one of these. Yeah, no ones here, please. Two up. So let's, uh... You're good. Yeah. Let's put a heavy stubber and clearance incinerator into this squad. Heavy stubber. We're moving on fives now because he moved. Winning on fives. You get your three up save. Yep. Because they get three up, right? Yeah, well, four have, up at least. They have three up ace. Z flamers. Three shots. Wounded, are they toughness? Oh, They're toughness five. So, so four that's, is, that's four is to wound. So four, uh, Minus four. one. Yeah. So four is now. Uh, so two wounds. Two yeah. They have three wounds each, right? Yep. One, this one. Yeah. Two auto guns can see the same squad, but obscured, so hitting on fives. Uh, yep. Yep. Okay. I have this squad right here. They'll fire everything at them. D6 auto hits with the flamer. One. Four is to wound. Yes. It's minus one. Yeah. So you're getting your four up save, otherwise the guy dies. Yep. So no whammy. No, oh, he's that's gone. Win. Aww. And then the two auto pistol shots. Hey, they both hit. Fives. They don't wound at well. Primus is going to declare a charge into the squad of Vanguard, who can overwatch. One Rad Carbine hitting on sixes. Sixes. No. Uh, no, no you know what? No, yes, yeah, right, because you're doing a reroll morale anyways. And because you might kill them anyway, I'm just going to supercharge my plasma. Yeah, they got to do them one at a time then. Yeah. Sixes to hit, ones kill you. One hit, okay. and what's about the other okay. guy? And uh, one dead. Oh, one dies. Boom! So, we're on a two. Two. I don't yeah. get a, I, that would be a minus three, so I guess I have a six up save. No, so two damage. And the arc rifle hit on sixes. Uh, no, no. Brings me down to three wounds and then I'll just do my minimum charge. No way. He will then attack, hoping to kill him down to a man and for the rest not to run. Although you have lost a lot of them this turn, so you're probably gonna run yeah. from morale anyways. Two's to hit. Oh. oh Two's no. to wound, sixes are AP minus four. So that just straight oh, up kills no. one. Oh. And this is minus one, oh, so you get a five up. Hey, no, this guy's here. Hey! Oh. So two die, which two do you want to die? Yeah, well, uh, hmm. <laughs> hmm. I'm not going to kill him in close combat or anything. Uh, although you're just going to stay in combat anyway. Might as well. There's no reason not to. Yeah, these two. Which side was holding over there? There. Uh, ha-ha! 
I will pile in. So you can fight back. You get one attack back. Hang on to four. Oh, look, hey, you have toughness. Three. You're toughness. I'm just toughness three. Yeah, but minus one, so your toughness two. Toughness oh no, now. toughness two. Oh no, yeah. Three to wounds. Oh, oh, five up save. Yeah. Hey, oh, I yeah, saved yeah. it. Morale. How many yeah. did you lose? Um, How I, many were there when they got I up there? Seven. So you've lost six. Yeah. So there, he's leadership seven. Uh, he's leadership so you want to roll? No, he's leadership six. Why? Yeah, oh, there's six and then seven. Six. Yeah. Okay, so he runs. Yeah. Unless you want to spend two command points to keep him. No. Huh? Huh? No. You sure? No. Yeah. <laughs> Leadership seven yeah. on this squad that lost two. So let's test if the servitor runs away. He doesn't know how to. <clears throat> Which makes care. total sense. Sixes. Well, I gave him the six over. So six and okay. He's he doesn't. And <laughs> this big old squad lost some though. Yeah, they might. I think they only lost because they weren't at full strength. I think they were at nine to start. So they lost seven. I'm pretty sure he lost seven, unless you think otherwise. Yeah, they, I separated them, but no, they're. So one, sure. nobody runs. Yeah. And two, one of them runs. Yeah. Three, they all run. They all run. They all run, too. Do you want to reroll? Or do you want them to run so they can come back at full health? Do I want to reroll? Earlier than later. But it is kind of a conundrum, because um, everything that comes. I get everything back on a two up. I mean, those, but. But at the end of your movement. Everything that comes back. Is you could roll a six and have them show up on the right yeah, on but my side. Yeah, I have board. to move up again. And but if you roll a six, they show up on this, this side. Entire, yeah, but yeah, the thing is, this entire mission is just a matter of time. Yeah. So you have to end the game before I get to the objectives. It's pretty All of the objectives. Thing. And that's why that's why I keep spending the command points to bring my cheap guys back, right? Because those few extra guys just, can make all the difference. I'm just going to let them run. Okay. Moving for you. They um, move nine? They move eight. Oh, there we go. So um, no point using grappling hooks on... I guess technically they should move. Nah, it's fine. Just go through. Uh, okay. Whatever. They're not going to be able to reach it. And then all your guys over here are just going to kind of shuffle around to get... This is called retribution. Hey! You might kill her more if alone. Yep. But the slow advance. Slowly advance. It's okay. They're going to... At the last moment, they're all going to grapple up there. Or grapple <laughs> up there. Just... <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if we did... <laughs> We could take off the, the, the train piece to resemble it crumbling down. Yeah, it's just gonna go. <laughs> oh, God. Dominus, where are you gonna go? Uh, buddy. <laughs> buddy. Here. Right in the middle, so you get six so, inches so to them, too. Six there you are. Yeah. They didn't crawl, or we'll move forward. Hello. You can't escape. <laughs> the Goliath Rocker is like, fine. You can't escape. <laughs> Come kill me. It doesn't matter anyway. Nobody likes me. And it's here, will hop up. Boom. Hey guys. So we got some possible reinforcements. You want to start with these guys? Yeah, let's start so with two plus. Story. Two plus for them. Yes. yes. Two plus for them. Two plus for them. Yes. Four plus for them. Now, I'm now watch me roll two twos for the next ones. So um, four plus for them. Yes. Okay. And then four plus for them. Oh. Hey, no problem. Ah. Let's roll for which table edge. It's just yes. a, whether you roll six or not. So one after another. Actually, I, I'm most interested. So first up with them, maybe. Okay. So, I'm, so you I'm roll just a, for anything, a six, anything right? but a six is yeah. not good, or you don't care. Oh. oh, what about them? Keep going. Keep going. No. no. Them. No. no. And them. Rostockers. No. no. So they all come in on your table edge. These come in on any table edge. Okay. Just remember, you can't come within 12 inches mm -hmm. of my clavicus. He's got that bubble. And I realize that your dragoons don't really care where they go. No, I. Uh, so they're actually going to come on the same side. No, I would have liked it for the rust augers. Yes, that would have been awesome. Them? No, no. Yeah, so, so you changed your mind, decided to put it at the back, just uh, more than 12 inches away. Right. And then on the other side, we've got your rust stalkers, your rangers, and your vanguard. All ready to go, ready to parte. The infiltrators will fire their flesh at blasters of this neophyte hybrid squad, which will be obscured. Four is to hit because of the obscureness. Okay. Four is to wound. No AP. Only six managed to get through. I got a three up save with my hardcover. Oh, only one dies. And there's an Acolyte Icon Ward. Six plus. Oh, he doesn't even die. Rangers. Neophytes. Ten shots with the rifles. Hitting on fours because it was cured. Yep. Winning on threes. I have fours because strength. Uh, no, threes, yeah. Yeah, I was going to say they're only strength. They're yeah, strength yeah they're four. strength four, yeah. Any AP? No. Three up. Okay. One maybe dies. Six up. It does. How wonderful for you. The plasma. Hold on. Are you going to overcharge him? No. <laughs> no I can, point. I can ignore wounds, remember? So, yeah, sure. Whatever. Three's to wound. Two. Two's to wound. Minus three. Uh, three, yeah. So six up safe. Okay. You're going to watch. I'm going to roll six right here, and you're going to wish you had overcharged. If you do, I... Oh, no. It didn't work. A flamer. And then, finally... Arc, arc rifles. Arc rifles. Four. Mm. Nothing. 
Have your arc rifles into the, to the, uh, the Goliath? Yeah, into the Goliath. The Goliath. You'd change your mind because these guys are like, hey, other arc targets, beep boop. The first one will fire unobscured into that one with his neutron laser oh. and heavy stubborn with them. Actually, I can see those guys. Okay, heavy stubborn yeah. to them, not obscured. Unobscured. And D3 shots. Three, three shots hitting on three. threes. Uh, of course, there will be Threes to wound? Yes. yes. D6 damage, minimum three. Uh, four. four. Just throw it into the pile of dice there to make it <laughs> unsure. Six is to ignore. One ignored. So this truck is now down to four wounds. Heavy stubborn to them. Sorry, into them. Into them. So threes to hit. Threes. As you can see the first guy. Uh, Come on, man. If you're twos, threes to wound. Three up yeah. save. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Second Next one, same yeah. thing. Yep. Yeah. He's obscured yeah. to the Goliath. So D3 oh shots. Uh, three shots. Fours to hit. I'm gonna block you from throwing it into all the other dice. One. Only one hits. Threes to wound. No, no, it doesn't do anything. The heavy stubber. Hitting on fours. Okay. So threes. He's not obscured to them. Three okay. hits. Threes to wound. Uh, three wounds. Three, three up saves. <laughs> Lots of threes here. Oh, he oh. kills three maybe. Six is to ignore. Okay. Not ignored. One, two, three. Your leader will fire at them. Yep. D3 three shots. Three, Hitting on fours because they're obscured and yep. moved. Exactly. Two hits, threes, two twos to wound. Yep. Yeah. AP? Minus two. Five up. Six is to ignore it. One dies. My leader's still alive. But the Anne Foster Serpent. Oh. So, uh. Look at it. It's oh, three, it was three to hit, yeah? Yeah. And, uh, threes. Ah! Oh. Command point. <laughs> yes. Five up, I get a command point. Oh! And you ignore cover with this? Yeah. But any so, AP? So, yeah. You minus one, so you have a six. Six up! up. No! Oh. <laughs> What's there? To, <laughs> you don't have to assault the shield generator ever again. Okay, it's, constant. If you no, fail, let's just leave I'm it alone. Determined. I'm determined. Leave. Or maybe as soon as you get it, I'm going to do the mission against you. Everything. Show you how it's done. Just gene stealers. Nothing but gene stealers. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? You know, at least you charge me then. Yeah, exactly. And so everything that can into them, which is everything except this plasma caliber and these three sure. regular carbines. Rad carbines hitting on fours. Yep, because obscured. Uh, uh, oh. oh. Fours to Four. wound! And then I got my. Ooh, uh, three up saves! Wait, there was a six in there, just do it separately. What's the two damage? Yeah. Okay. Three up. Oh, they survived! Hardcover for the win! Okay, arc rifle. On a four. Mm. Okay, on a two. Mm. Yeah, okay, AP. look at that. Minus one. Four up. Yeah. Oh! Okay. Yeah, I no, believe yeah. I can six! Easy, easy. Yeah, no. I'm alive! Okay. Okay, <laughs> oh, no! No, no, no problem. Here's what else you got? Yeah, I'll overshot this half plasma caliber. You're in short charge of plasma caliber. Uh, okay. Oh, you hit my two's to wound. Okay. Minus wound. three. Yep. Six yep. up saves. Yep, yep. No, I don't stop any, so I got four. You yep. did four damage to yep. him. Yep, yep, okay. Yeah, yeah. You, you got him. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, <laughs> We're changing plasma! It, it, just, it just took, yeah, okay. Okay, this mission is so ridiculous. <laughs> And then the rest you forgot to specify, but we're going to the jackals. Yeah. Plasma, it's minus one, so do you want to overcharge? No. Good. Uh, Miss. Yeah, yeah. Miss. Because they're always minus one. Yep. And the carbines <laughs> hitting on three fours, fours because of my okay, minus one. Yeah. And then wounding on fives. Okay. And no uh, AP, so five up saves. Aww. Super. Uh -huh. Thank you, Matthew. <laughs> this guy's turning around going, you killed my friends. <laughs> So Heavy grav. Grav first, so on five. The yeah, F5s, he's going to be partially obscured. Yeah, fives. Ha! <laughs> Look at that! Four hits. Oh, he, is, he is ticked off. Talk about revenge, man. Three's to wound. Okay, three. Five up in bomb. Yeah. Oh, wow. he's down to one wound. Can you get him off with your phosphor maybe, blaster? Maybe, maybe. You're looking at fives to hit. No. Nope. Oh, okay. No, you tried. You tried. <laughs> yeah, now the arc rifles want to try to finish off that Goliath. Not obscured, so hit on fours. Uh, Rerolling ones, because the tech priest is nearby. Yeah, tech priest is there. Uh, two. Sure. Mm. Mm. Um, strength six, so on five. Fives. Okay. AP? Minus two. Six up. Oh. Hmm. What about oh. the grav? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Yep, you a Minecraft three. villager? Yeah. Grav are going this way. Phosphors are going this way. Hey, you change your mind when you realize you're obscuring yourself and you'll be sixes to hits. Everything to them. Kill that incinerator. The grav will hit on fives because it's minus one. No, come on, guys. Cooperate here. Ah, so fives. 
Uh, oh, yeah, well, that's pretty good. Points to reroll. Reroll. Uh, oh, it's another one. Threes to wounds. This is gonna hurt. I don't get any saves against these, so they're dead. Because you just did six wounds and I had five left. Last pistol! Why not, right? On a three? Three or four? Four is to wound? Four is to wound? Four is to wound. And no. Nope. Virgin, where are you gonna start? I'm gonna start with the, with the rest of our stone here. Okay, I'm gonna overwatch. Yeah. Okay. Seven shots hitting on sixes, and Bring any it. sixes will make more attacks. Bring it. Hmm. Huh. Okay. You need a five inch charge to get to him. <laughs> does that feel better? Go ahead and put him up there. Yes, it actually really, really does. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> them first. They're gonna charge? Yeah. Overwatch. Pistols. Hey, one hits. Didn't wound. Charging, six hey. inches. You just wanna put him in? Uh, yeah, like that. And then he's gonna charge? Actually. Try to get up as far as possible. Uh, get ready to grapple like, up there. I spoke them like that. Sure. And then he's gonna charge. Yep. He doesn't have to roll if you just wanna go yep. there. Whoa, jeez. Uh, Whoa, jeez, uh, man. Cheese man. Um, so you want to beat them up with your servitors first? Like, uh, be like a man? Yes. Like a serve a man? Fours to hit. Three times each force to hit, yeah. Okay. And then strength six. Threes to wound. So threes to wound. Any AP? A minus one. Six up. One, two, three, four. And then your tech freeze. Can you finish him off? Otherwise I'm going to just fall back and be a pain in the butt. Three attacks on threes. Okay. Strength? Five, so on three. Threes, AP. Uh, minus two, two oh, damage. Yeah, it's dead. It's dead. These guys, oh wait, no, they couldn't have done it. Never mind, there was still a guy there. Never mind. Forgot to charge over here. What's their charge target? I think they're gonna have to declare both of them, otherwise. Yep, they will declare both of them. Might as yeah, well. you can't get to the one without the other. No. Yeah. Okay, I'll overwatch. I got a flamer here and a couple grenade launchers, auto guns, a few of them. Let's toss a couple crack grenades. No. Oh, one flamer. Hits five times. Okay. Wounded on threes. With height advantage, that's minus one, so you get a four up or five up? Five up. Four up base. So, so uh, one and a half we'll, die. Yep. And then we'll toss a blasting charge, which does four hits, which we'll throw in with the auto guns. Hitting on sixes. Ooh, four hits. Yeah. Winning on fives. No, fours. fours. Yeah. So two wounds. If you fail one of these, there's also height advantage. Oh, you got it. One and a half. This guy and uh, the other back one will, yeah. You need to roll an 8-inch charge to get there. Oh, ten. That's ten! Woo! Well, you can make charges. Only one guy's going to be able to fit up there. But he can... I'm sure he can do something. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think he can get more than one guy. Once he starts killing guys... Well, I could put... One oh, there you go. There. Oh, no, he wouldn't. Uh, no, he wouldn't. Uh, oh, it's he, fine! It's fine. Just okay. keep the other two at the bottom. We're good. So then they get to go. I don't think I'd interrupt. Part of me wants to, but it apart just doesn't Command care. Command to give them plus one to hit. Okay. So they hit on twos now? Yep. Um, and they're going to attack... Question. I think they're all going to go into the big spot. Big spot. Yeah. So, so five attacks hitting on twos, but fives are, are three hits. Yep. Oh! So uh, 12 hits out of five. Strength. Six. Ah, twos to wound. On twos. Oh, there, whoa, that's oh, a lot of ones. Oh, look at all the ones. All the ones. There's seven wins. What's the AP? Nothing? Um, Five up saves. Ah! Saved one. Six up to ignore it. Ah, oh, you only killed two! Oh no! The immortal neophytes. Oh, I'm laughing and I'm feeling the pain at the same time. Oh boy. Such mixed emotions. Well, I guess I get to fight back. I'll just do them all at the same time because there's no way that you're yeah, gonna kill this guy yeah. and then remove these two. Yeah. So 12 attacks. There's no negatives or anything against these guys? No. So four is to hit. And four is to wound. Oh, goodness. Yep. Four up saves. Watch them kill more oh. than I have. <laughs> oh, One four One guy, wins. two guy, two and a half. So uh, can we have a round of applause for these neophytes? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> so we got some morale, and I think you got to do yours first. Yeah. They, I lost turn. three this round. Three, and their leadership eight? Seven. Seven. So if you roll six, you lose them both? Yep. Do you want to use two command points to not even roll? Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, I will. Yeah, I will. You will? Okay. Yeah. Five up, I get a command point when you do that. Nope. I lost two from this squad, so they can't run. And we forgot to charge him this year, too. So do you want to charge? Yeah, I wanted to charge him. Okay. I'll overwatch with my... 
Needle pistol. Hits on a six. No. Okay. You're in. I... Uh... I spend two command points to go before you. I could. Yeah. I will. Five plus I get a command point. Hey! It only cost me one. Toxin injector. Hitting on twos. And then auto wounded on two sixes are AP minus four. So this is minus one otherwise. You get four up saves. How many wounds does an engine here Four. Okay, so if you failed all four, yeah, that's not going to happen though. If you didn't fail, oh, you failed one. Now you can have me back. I'll, I'll try the servo arm. It just hits on, it only hits on five, I think, but. Oh, um, so it does lots of damage. Yeah, but it has three damage, so. Uh, Five's to hit. Uh, no. no. And then the axe. Ugh. Four's to hit? No, not that. Okay. So it goes on to my turn four then. Yeah. Oh boy, this is quite the nail biter. Awesome. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> gonna randomize your canticle? Yeah, I, I really am out of all my good ones. All right, oh, go no. then. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna yeah. roll. Um, okay, that is nothing. <laughs> Did you do that? <laughs> Trick shot. Okay, that is five. five. That's it, the it, reroll ones to hit, or is that the... No, no, no. Uh, or is that the reroll morale? It's plus one strength. Mm. Okay, sure. uh, yeah, yeah, my hair. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna spend a command point. So five plus, so it's a new round, so yeah. do this again. Nope. To get D6 of these guys back. Just two. Isn't that how many you killed? <laughs> exactly. I imagine they were, they're just the exact same dudes. It's, yeah. it, it is them. They just <laughs> they, survived. They, they just actually got back up. They're like, they nah, JK. <laughs> J, JK. It's so funny, isn't it? JK. Yeah. <laughs> JK. <laughs> Fall back and shoot. Here we go. The Magus will make sure it's in line of sight of those guys. He's going to advance. Whoop! <laughs> Nope! 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 nope. <laughs> Goliath Rock Grinder will come up here. Hey, guy. How's it going? You're, hey, you're you closest just, to me now. You charge me? I do. <laughs> we're not called a rock grinder for nothing. <laughs> Whoop! Aww. We're, we're, gonna, we're gonna fall back to. You know what? I can get around you, so I'm gonna come over here. Oh, no. Like to here. And then I'll make sure that these guys are Fine. closer. Be annoying. <laughs> yeah. This is my job. <laughs> This is my job. Magus will make sure he's the closest. Uh, smite! Oh. Five plus. I got it. D3 mortal wounds. And two of them. He's down to one wound. <laughs> Bam! Oh, my head! Smite! Only to six. I got it. And oh, three got mortal wounds. That's all that was left. Oh! I didn't need to fall back. I guess it didn't hurt. Mortars! Gonna rain down death and destruction. On your, I don't know which one's more effective. Depends. These guys aren't in cover right now, but they're also two wounds no. each. I could have brought them into cover if I. Yeah, that's true. You could have. <laughs> we just kind of rushed that combat, so we'll pretend they're all in cover. Uh, let's drop it down on the longer range guys. Yeah, that seems right. Three d six shots, ten. Four is to hit. Three is to wound. Minus one because they have height advantage. You get a five up save. And five oh. die. <laughs> duk, 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 duk. Oh, that is, man. Oh. Next time, nothing but mortars. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know, I've actually been forgetting this whole time. I get a four up involved with this thing. Oh yeah. There's been so many times I've been doing six up saves. Oh yeah. So if anybody's already posted in the comments, or probably ten of you have already posted in the comments, you're right. That would have made this game even more annoying. Yeah. Do you want me to leave? <laughs> I could just go. Just go okay. home. Just go home, man. I could just fly home. I'm gonna fire everything at him. Start with the incinerator. Burn an 18, the burner! He's toughness 4, strength 5, so 3's to wound. Okay. These are all minus 1. Yep. So what do you have? A 3 up yeah. or a 4 up instead? Uh, um, 2 up base, so 3 up. 3 up. Ugh. Ow. <laughs> 3 ow, wounds. Ow. <laughs> hot, 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 He's at 2. 2 wounds left, and I got my stubber. Hitting on 5's. Oh no, that's no. embarrassing. Three's to wound? So, oh. oh no, he's got a two up save. Those no, double ones, man, to die. Double ones to die. Whoa! Oh, where's my height advantage now? <laughs> you realize that means it like, almost got through his armor, right? <laughs> uh, needle pistol. I fell back, so it's harder to hit. Yeah, I miss. Uh, everything here crack grenades. Uh, crack grenades hit on fours. We roll ones. The premise is right there. Watching. Three's to wound. Three's, yeah. It's minus two, so you're... No, a grip. Crack grenade is not minus two. It sure is. The missile is minus two. The minus, one, is minus one, you're right. So, so on a three. Okay. You're fine. 
blasting charge, one shot, with the auto guns hitting on fours. Fives to wound, two oh, no. wounds with your two up save because of cover. Oh no, you're live. Okay. Two crack grenades and all them into him as well. Oh, he's a character. I can't do that. I don't want to shoot anything else. No. Don't want to. Oh, two crack grenades into them. Yeah. Okay. Why not, right? Fours to hit, re-rolling ones. Threes to wound. It's height advantage, so you'll have a right, six up actually. Six up. Uh, oh, yeah, I made it. No, <laughs> yeah, I, I made it. <laughs> Both, right? Charge, just into him. Nice try. Why? Why? Because I want to make Tech Priest Dominus uh, flakes at the back. D three shots with his thingy. D three. One so shot one. with his thingy. Hitting six. on a five. Uh, six oh, right, because you. Shot. Oh yeah, look, that's an extra shot. Uh, the the which uh, misses? Yeah, strength. Um, I think it's strength eight now. So it's still strength six. Five to wound. Uh, yep, yeah, that is minus four. Don't get a save. And d three damage. Uh, that is a two. Which I ignore. And six is one. Well, it does bring him down to less attacks now. Yep. Bah! Oh, you had the phosphorus serpent tattoo. No, oh, sir. No. Charging. Okay, ass pistol over one. You could do it! Hey, yeah! It's a hit, because it's on a five now. Uh, no. no wound. Charged. Overkill, overkill. Well, we'll see. He still has a three up save against these guys. Beat the crap out of him. What you doing on our turf? Get lost, little guy. This is our shield generator. You're gonna start here. So actually, I'm not at my lowest bracket. Uh, two would have been. So I get D6 attacks, so three, and I get D3 extra for charging, so three more. Hitting on fours. Oh, he's a strength ten. Two's to wound. And these are all minus two. So fours. minus two. So four up saves. They're oh, D3 no. damage each. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! He's dead. Oh, no. He doesn't oh, no. ignore damage at all, right? He does. He I'm does. Six. Okay. Well, he just took Good. seven wounds. So you need to roll six out of seven sixes. Yep, no problem, man. No there's, problem. there's a chance. Yeah, we won't talk it. about what it is. Sure. Never yeah, tell yeah, me the odds. No, yeah, yeah, okay. you, got, you got the opposite, yeah, man. Okay, you, yeah, okay. Okay, I said six out of seven. What you did was six out of seven misses. Uh, uh, were, you, were you not paying attention? Sorry, I thought it was the other one. Yeah, yeah, well, next sorry. time. Sorry. You'll figure it out. You'll figure yeah, it out. Sorry. I am not going to consolidate into them. Sure. Because they'll beat me up. Because they're bullies. You want to interrupt me? Two command points? So you can kill two guys? No, you don't. You don't. Five attacks. Five attacks, hitting on fours. Hmm. Okay. Oh, wait, no, hitting on threes, because the oh, yeah. Primus is right there. Does he give three rolls to one? No, that's no. shooting. That's, that's three rolls, one to shooting. He gives plus one to hit rolls yeah, for everybody yeah, within yeah. six inches. That's his base ability. Uh, strength three, so fives to wound. Yep. Two wounds. Sure. Three up saves. He's only got one wound left. Oh no! Oh, how embarrassing! Hey, hey, hey. Hey, he's like, I got this guy's grenade to the I face. Hey, oh, oh, auto gun! On oh, the back of the auto gun. What's our defense against that? Oh, I don't know. That's not fair, man. Uh, okay, not a bad turn no. four for me. No. That was turn four for me, right? Uh, yeah. 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 So killed your engine seer, yeah. killed your tech priest dominus, both which can come back on fours, yeah. uh, but not where you want them to be anymore. No. And oh yeah, and I mortal wounded those. Two guys to death, so they're gone now. I don't know, man. It's not looking good. Your turn four. Comes back on a four. No, he comes back on a four. I'm yes, sure he does. on a six he gets Wait. to choose a side. Wait. No, we got to roll for them too. Oh, that's a unit. That's right. So yeah. they come back on a four. Uh, no. No. Okay. So he gets to come back on his side. That oh. makes him super useful. He's just gonna join his buddies. Yeah, holy within six. Yeah, he doesn't walk on, so he just plop him in there. And everybody moves forward. Keep moving uh, forward. You realize you probably should advance them, so you do. So six, six inches. inches. That just just push them right up against there. Bam! That's right. One command point grapple launchers, baby. Uh, sir? <laughs> Something bigger just showed up! Five plus, I got a command point. Yay! Oh no, I already did that this battle round. Did I? No, you didn't. Oh, not yet. I didn't do it in my turn. I tried it and I failed. Engine Seer is gonna run. Oh no, he doesn't move. He showed up at the end of your movement. Oh, yeah, That's what yeah. we're supposed yeah, to yeah, do. Yeah, right. no, we did that wrong. 
We forgot to roll Battle Shock for these guys last oh, time. Yeah, we you lost five of them, they're leadership seven. Yep. So, so one or two, uh, you're fine. Uh, two, yeah. you're fine. Six brings him to there. Hey, buddies. Dune Crawler's gonna back up and start firing at the useful stuff. I'm trying to hide there, buddy. <laughs> uh, I don't think so. Can. These guys will Here. think they're awesome by going after those two little jackals. Yep, yep. Yeah, always. So, servitor number um, 3476. Five, five inches, five inches. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm measuring my, my um, yeah. Right, I was just uh, checking the two inch uh, thingy he has, you know, that was why I was. Yeah, <laughs> yep, exactly. <laughs> yep. Five inches. Uh, Zip. Boop. And your vanguard. And just here is a reposition, uh, just yeah, to keep they, helping they, out these guys in case I ever decide to shoot at them. Yeah. Which I won't. Stubber to them, neutron laser to the Goliath rock grinder. Not obscured for the rock grinder. D3 shots. D3. I think you're gonna get him. Threes to hit. Let's see. Uh, threes. Okay. okay, only two hit. Threes to wound though. Okay, now, yeah, that's, that's seven. I don't get to save. So 2d6 damage, minimum oh, that three. That was, wait. No, no, that wasn't seven, that was your wounds. Threes to wound. Okay. <laughs> How much damage? That's uh, uh, well, 11! It's 11! Sure, now, great, thanks. Yeah. Ah, uh, I didn't save it. Okay. See, little did you know, though, that inside of this one is all just full of Prometheum and caches of demolition charges. Mm -hmm. It's rigged to blow. Oh, yeah. Which means I'm gonna spend a command point so I don't have to roll to see if it blows I, but, up. But of course I knew that, that's why I positioned... Uh, yeah, all your guys within like, six like, inches like, of it? <laughs> yeah, obviously I remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. Uh, they're out of range, but obviously they're in range, they're in range, they're in range. So I spent a command point, D3 mortal wounds. Oh! Okay. Three of them die. Oh, I should have rolled that for that guy. Three again? Just two on him. Minimum two. There we go, and I killed one of them. He's down to a wound. Boom! Mushroom cloud. Then you got the heavy stubbers into the neophytes hitting on fours yeah. in this case. Fours. And threes. Threes. With a three up save. Saved. Three. Can see this guy. Obviously obscured, so it's gonna fire this squad. Fives to hit. Oh, oh not okay. bad. Yeah. That was better than fours to hit. Why? Threes to wound. Um, Look at that. Oh yeah. I'm gonna get a six up save thanks to my yep. hard cover. Mm, he just Ooh. killed seven of them. That's how many were in that squad. Huh. So I guess you wasted those phosphor shots. Oh, dang, no, that is, that's such a shame. Now you have the nearest character, is him, because they're too yeah. far away, and the other things that are closer are our character. So they're going to try to take down the Magus. Yeah, we'll just... Good luck, I say. Well, it's fours. It's hit on fours. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay, yeah, good, good, good. So twos now, right? Twos to wound. Okay, AP. Minus two. So I'll get my five up. Okay. How much damage each? Hold on, hold on. It's How much damage each? D3. Okay, what I'm going to do instead is pass them off oh. before you do the D3. So if I pass them off, it just doesn't do anything. Okay. Four up. He passes off one of them, so that kills one of those neophytes. D3 damage to him now. Uh, one damage. So he takes one wound, and it... And he's like, no! Oh, not him, he's the leader. No! Blam! Pasted. <laughs> Sorry, he only starts at four wounds. He's down to three. Oh, wait. Does he lose that wound? Oh, I didn't lose the wound! No, oh, I'm sorry! Shoot! Arc pistol! Arc pistol. Actually, I can do all of the arc stuff at the same sure. time. So here, I'm scared. five shots. Fours to hit. Fours. Three. Huh. Damage, or strength? It's two. It's six, so two. Twos. AP? Uh, two. And my, one. One? Wow, so four up. Six is to ignore. Two okay. die. Uh, you, and you. Galvanic, the one rapid firing galvanic rifle. Um, on Four's that. to hit, three's to wound. Yep. And uh, is that, that your extra AP? That is minus one. That is minus nothing. Four up, three up. And they'll fire at the megas as well. Rad carbines first in on fours because I'm obscured. Okay. We did on fours. Sixes do double damage. Uh, no double four, damage. Four. No AP. So I got my three up armor save. And I will, yeah, I'll pass it off. Maybe four plus to pass it off? Nope, so six plus to ignore it. All right, take a wound. So down to three wounds. I'll supercharge my plasma. Ooh. So um, that is a, a Four death. is to hit. Oh. A death. I'll, I'll, I'll... Oh, you know what, you didn't need to, thankfully you only got one death. Yeah, okay. So one dies. So um, two hits, two to wound. 
AP okay. minus three, so yep. I get a six up save. Saved oh. one. I will try to pass off the other one, which I do. Okay. So one of your plasma dies. One of my guys dies. Seems like a fair trade. Yeah. And then arc rifle four. Nice and minus two because two six. Uh, yes. AP minus one. Four up. Saved. Mm. Grab cannon into these guys who are obscured. Four so, so fives uh, to hit. Fives to hit. Ooh, oh, he's really four hits. Now. He's, oh. this guy, Yeah, he keeps doing that. He did that to the Keller Morph as well. Threes oh, to wound. Three wound. Uh, four six wounds. up. Six up. Six up. Six up. Three die. You three. And the phosphor. Oh yeah. Hits. Of course it hits. Strength. Five, so threes. Threes. No. Tune crawler, everything into them. They're obscured. He can see this guy. Yep. This heavy stubber this time. So uh, fours to hit. Fours to hit. Uh, yep. One and hit and uh, three. Okay. Three up save. Kills one. Super effective. Then I guess he'll have to totally annihilate. <laughs> D three <laughs> neutron laser blast. Oh yeah. Three shot. Hey. Oh, yeah. On fours. No kill like overkill. Two hits. Two. Two's to wound. Two's to wound. Yes. I don't get a save against these. It's AP minus four. Yep. <laughs> Okay, so two more die. I'll keep my leader alive. Blam! <laughs> Blam! Charging here, I don't care about overwatching. Anything but a double one and you're in. You're in. A, yeah. Just jump in. You're in. Now attack. Oh, they're dead. Oh, no. oh what a surprise. Uh, <laughs> morale, I lost five guys right here. I'm leadership eight. Woo-hoo! Hoo-wee! If I roll a six, I would lose both of them. Five. So hold on, I lost five, so that's ten. So I would lose... Two of them, so it becomes one. You know what? I'll just keep it. I'll just... You know what? At this point, I don't need to keep my leader. Yeah. Lost two here from them jumping in front of the Magus, but that's not enough to make them care. Lost two here, but a leadership bait. Also don't care. That was your turn four, and now it's my turn five. What canicle do you want? Uh, you want to just roll? Uh, yes. Here. Roll. Oh, you were a plus one strength in close combat, too. It didn't matter. Just roll. Yeah. yeah. Mm, two. Uh, two. That's the one that hurts everything near you right now. You know what? I'll spend a command point to re-roll it just because... Okay. Three. On a five plus, I get your command point. No. What's three? We roll ones when you're fighting in the fight phase. You know what? I like that, actually. Yeah, you know, that'll work yeah. well when they jump up there. Yeah. If they're still alive. Which they will be. <laughs> My army is now just these guys. Everything that's up here. That's it. That's it. So all I have to do is survive and hope the game ends. If the game ends turn five, you lose. There's yeah, no way you get this. Pretty much. So I just need to... You know, if I need to snipe these three. If I can snipe those three, then you've got... It's gonna be hard for you to get over here. Yeah. You've got you've got engine series and stuff, but yeah, yeah that's my goal. First, a command point to bring back D6 hybrids or neophyte hybrids on a five plus. I will get that's now a free command point, and I get D6 of this squad. Okay. Six of them. Oh, of course. Hoo wee! There they are. That looks a little better. <laughs> I always imagine it right now that you're just exploding in there. There's explosions. You're like, we got them, and then the heads all pop back up. <laughs> All right, Magus number one. You got a simple job. Smite. Magus numero do. Stop. And then we'll move these guys up so we have some a blade of wounds you. for the Magus. Yeah. Yep. Actually, I'm going to rearrange these a little bit so they come like this. The Magus will come all the way over to here. And then the Accolade Icon Ward will come up. Primus will also come up. And then we'll bring these guys over as well. I'm trying to limit what can see them. You know what? I should just hide them. Yeah, let's hide them. Yeah, as best as I can. Smite. Got it. D3 mortal wounds. Three mortal wounds! I kill one! If I kill him, can you... Mm. Nope, I cannot smite them now. Boo! Well, you know what, that means I, I killed one so effectively. Yeah. yeah, that was my mistake. He should have started. Mm. And then he would have still been able to smite. So then he'll just... I don't want to smite. Uh. Uh. Mass hypnosis. Fails it, who cares. Let's fire at them now. We got two crack grenades coming your way. One hits. And wounds. Minus one. Well, you got like a. Uh, you two could. up still. Yeah, because it's supposed to. Yeah. I'll do a needle shot. Yeah, it's a hit. It's a wound. You got a two up save. You're good. I don't think I'm going to bother shooting at them. Let's uh, shoot at this guy, though. We'll put a flamer into him and everything else. Five hits. 
fives to wound. One wound with minus one, so you get a five up. Five up on him. He's dead. I'll take it. I know he's long range, but get on my lines. That was a tactical blunder on my part. I wanted him to stay alive because I want to keep you at those low squads, right? Oh, put the mortars into them as well. Why not? That many shots, nine. Fours to hit. Fives to wound. Three wounds, two up saves. Oh, I got one. Emboldened. Auto pistols. One hits. Nothing. Charge. One of them can see for the overwatch, hitting on fives. Yep, so one hit. Strength? Um, six, so... so twos. twos. Oh. oh, okay. Charge. Yeah. He'll charge into here, and then the Acolyte Icon Ward will charge in as well. Actually... Yeah, he fails. Okay, good. The uh, this Magus this Magus will charge. Six. I'm gonna actually reroll the two. I'm gonna get seven. There we go. Oh, that way he can come this way, and then the other Magus will declare a charge as well. And get in. Because they're surprisingly okay in combat. Let's fight! I'm going to start. I'm going to start with this Magus. Three attacks and on twos thanks to the Primus. Strength five, thanks to the staff, so four is to wound. So two wounds, minus one. Yeah, minus one, so you get five four up. up. Four, four up. Save. Yep. So, so D3 damage. Three. Got him. It okay. kills the one. Okay. Did you want to spend two command points to interrupt? Yeah. Sure, why not? Actually, I'm going to consolidate. You want to fight the red one then? Sure. Because that hasn't fight, fought yet. All the full disclosure, this yellow one has three wounds left. What would you like to do? Oh, you know what? He just does. He just has one damage attacks. Who does? He does. Yeah. And he's got three attacks. Yeah, he's not gonna. So at best, you can kill the yellow magus really then. Not gonna do anything. Do you want to spend the two command points then? No, I don't. Okay. Then I'll have my Primus go next. He can still pile in because he charged. Hitting on twos, wounding on twos. Oh, these are AP minus four. So just you get a six up invuln. Oh yeah, six, six, up, six up invuln. Yeah. Um, so, no. Two, no. Oh, one wound, okay. and then the other one's minus one, so five up. Uh, two wounds. No. So it's down to one. When the last Magus will attack, it on twos. Winning on fours. One wound, minus one. You got a five up save, or you're dead. Or four up save, because oh. they have three base. Oh, that's right. So you have one wound left. Huh. Okay. Now I can fight back, targeting the Magus that's already hurt. Um, actually, the, the Primus Oh, the Primus was, was hurt, too. Yeah. yeah, sorry, I forgot to move his wound token. I'll put it into the Primus. Sure. Yeah. No, no, stupid. Yeah, I'll put it into the Primus. I can shoot the Magus, so hopefully. Hopefully. Wait, well, you can fall back, I guess, if you want to drop back down. If you spend a command point on the grappling launchers. Uh, Attacking the Primus? Yeah. Hitting on? I'm gonna get, uh, fours. One hit. Strength? Uh, yeah, it's uh, six. Two. Yeah, so twos. AP? Um, minus one. Six up save. Damage? Just one. Okay. Down two. Oh, that's the end of my turn. So at this point, we realize that if the game does not continue past turn five, it is impossible for you to grab all three objectives. Mm -hmm. We've looked at all the different possibilities. So let's see if the game continues past turn five. Yeah. Three plus, it'll continue. Do I have to roll? Uh, do you want me to do it? Nobody gets to re-roll it. Sure, I'll roll it. Three plus, the game will go to turn six. Okay. Four plus, it'll go to turn seven. Oh. Hmm? Good game. There's no way I can get to turn seven. Yeah. There's yeah. no way. Okay, yeah, Shake my hand, man. <laughs> you win. You got it. You, does it feel like a victory? <laughs> Is this what victory feels like? No. <laughs> <laughs> you did it! Woo! <laughs> because there's no way. Basically, what we were looking at is if if the game was again in the turn five, and like he could grapple a launcher and advance this guy to get to here and be within three inches of the objective, and then these guys and these guys could all move and they could shoot the neophytes off, and then he'd have that objective. These guys could advance, get over to that objective. Oh, he still have the problem with those neophytes there. But you had no way to get to this objective, because those guys, guys can't get up there. So if the game ended, at best you had two objectives, if you found some way to kill all these neophytes. Um, at worst, you only had one. Turn six, though, I, I'm running out of guys. Like, I'll, yes, I'll smite him, I'll smite some other people. If I, like, 
I, and you've got guys that are going to come back. You've got right. possibly heavy grab cans I, that are going to show up. I, I mean, if, if, if this, I, I mean, if I just continue killing your guys like I have the past few turns. You are going to table me. Yeah. But that doesn't win you the game. You no, still have to hold I mean, all three objectives. Yeah. But if I do, then, then you have no guys left and I can just take the one. If, so the, if was, the game goes on long right, enough, it which just, it did. It, yeah, it was just a matter of how much time did I have left? Right. Yeah. yeah, well, we know that with infinite reserves. Yeah. That's why I was saying that. It's yeah. just I had to focus down the targets that were going to bother me the most. Yeah, it was, it was just a matter of time. You were just, uh, it, your whole point was to slow me down as much as possible. And to be honest, I and did that. Yeah, I right. think I think even if we'd have said turn six, I wouldn't be sure that you could win. It's once you'd rolled turn seven, I'm like, okay, there's no way I could survive turn seven without you grabbing all three objectives. Yeah. Okay, let's do the post-game stuff. Time for the post-game stuff where we calculate all our points. The first thing that we do is determine initiative, which is based on glory, which is based on wins. In our case, it's very simple. Whoever wins the game has initiative. It only becomes more complicated if we had a draw. So this time, Constantine has initiative. Now, first off, we just have to calculate campaign points, which is the top number of each of these. So let's start with Constantine, because he's had initiative. So zero, one, two, three, four, five, still five, still five, Six. Oh boy, only mm -hmm. six. That brings you up to 24. For me it's two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve! Huh? That brings me up, whoops, don't bend it, to 30. Next we look at the strategic goal and calculate bonus campaign points, which basically is you look at your biggest group together territory, and divide the number of um, locations by three, rounded down, and you get that many bonus. So for Constantine, the biggest will be these five, so that's worth one bonus campaign point. And my biggest is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, which is worth three. That brings you up to 25, and it brings me up to 33. So now I use the 31 and just wrap it around. Next, we earn our strategy points. So starting with Constantine, it's the bottom number of each of them. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. For me, it is zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you get twelve, I get ten. Going back and forth, we bought our strategic resources. Uh, Constantine, realizing that he's eight be points behind, actually bought the one that gives him D6 points and D3 points. This one actually is free for him because you have the fortified palace. Yeah. Special place. Do you? Unless you... Oh, no, yes, you have the Promethean reactor. That one's wait, not wait, free. Wait, 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 What's the... There is no fortified the palace. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, okay. It's fine. It's fine. You had points yeah, yeah, for it. Yeah, That's 13, point. and you had 14 because you yeah. had leftovers from last right, time. Yeah. And you got press the attack, which lets you seize an additional territory. So this is basically your last-ditch effort gambit kind of thing, right? I decided to go for ones that were all about affecting the next game, which is going to be our last game. I know we said we play 8 to 10, but it's taking so long to film these that we're only going to get it four done, where I get an extra relic, extra warlord trait, that is the Cities of Death warlord trait, and D3 extra command points that can only be spent on Cities of Death stratagems, which, totally easy. I can do that. So you get, which one do you want to do first? D3 extra campaign points or D6? D6. All right, D6. Yeah, 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 yeah. D6. Uh -huh. okay, oh, three. three. Okay, that's not horrible. Okay. It's not horrible. D3, D3. D3. Also three. So six five. more. Uh, six, yeah. yeah. Six, six more. Six. Yeah, yeah. That brings you to 31 points. So the score is 33 to 31. Yeah. And you spent 13 of your yeah, so I have 16. A, a so you have four, three So you have three left. Uh, 14. I have four, I had fourteen, so oh, I had, had one left. Yeah. Yeah, because twelve plus the. Yeah. No, you had the four extra right here. Oh wait 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 wait. No, wait, no wait. it wasn't the two. You no 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 yeah yeah it's thirteen and fourteen. Yeah. I, I moved it up to the two. So we both have one extra strategy point yeah. left for the last round. Okay, let's find out what a random event is for the last game. We ended up getting consolidate territory. That whoever has the um, most campaign points, which is me, can only choose to reinforce. So remember there is a table where one warlord chooses one thing and the other warlord chooses the other. I can only choose reinforce, so which means you get to choose. Right, I essentially get to choose between these five, which yeah. I want to take. Exactly. Yeah. So for your first choice, what are you going for? Yeah. You know one of them has to be the Age of City shield generator. I know. First up, I'm going to go for this one right here. 
So the Sector Mechanicus. Not worth any campaign points, though. No. In, you're just trying to link them up for the extra. Yeah. So you get to pick one first. Yeah. You get to take over one of mine as well. You're going to be taking over the Age of City Shield yeah. Generator. Yeah, this is what I'm going to take over, probably. So to link it up, probably this one is... All right, So because he's going for the campaign goal where he's going to be linking a big group. Okay. I am then going to take Hab Block 29. I get to choose two now because I'm the lowest. And I'm going to take this Hab Block down here worth the campaign point as well. And now you get to choose one extra, or another one, and then because of your press the attack, you can choose one more. So you actually get two more. So first. So obviously one yeah, of them has I'll to be. Take over this one. He worked so hard for it. <laughs> Seven turn <laughs> game for it. And for the last one, you're taking the Administratum District, which will actually link all of your guys together. So you actually have 12 linked together, which will get you four extra campaign points next round. And I only have 11 linked together. So already you're going to get one extra campaign point than me next turn. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. So that's it for this uh, battle report right here. The very last game four of four. I know we we're going to do more, but we just ran out of time. It took a lot longer to film these than I thought it would. We're going to be doing our final campaign. You know what? The campaign's close, though, so at least yeah. it's that. It's not a big runaway victory. Gene said a cult versus Admech in the mini wargaming vault at the link below. I'll see you there. Happy wargaming!